Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Um, he didn't realize that you know the Switch was two ninety nine and the PlayStation was mostly selling at one ninety nine. One ninety nine, exactly. Yeah. So obviously he's gonna make. You know, here's the thing. I even showed him. We all last year agreed. Everyone said. Everyone said. You know. Yep. Um, PlayStation won November last year, right? Yep. But the unit, but the console that had the most revenue was Xbox because. The yep. One X was $500. $500. And then, even here. then, even then now, I, was, I was saying that with everybody. Yeah. I'm like, yo, where did this shit change? I'm it like, where did this come <laughs> from? It just changed. Like, everybody changed. Like, this shit yeah. was this, like, instantaneous. I'm like, can't, yo, you know what it is? People were, 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 were banking on, on the Switch yeah. winning MPD, right? And yeah. no one can simply accept the L. Yep. Like just take the L. That's it. This That's is no it. different than any other month. Exactly. But and I, I try to tell him. I said, "Look, what is a couple of months compared to having five years straight MPD wins? Like, you have one win. Okay, that's fine. I get it. It it, it don't make it break anything, but it's not going to stop all the previous MPDs that PlayStation on. <laughs> and, and I try yeah. to tell Baron the Switch is a fucking ninth generation console. You lost with the Wii U. Yeah. They re upped and made another console to try to fucking." Uh, you know, get a head start. It is what it is. But yeah. he, man, dude's just in denial. So I, I, I don't know if he's playing dumb or he is dumb. Yo, I don't know. But all I know is uh, I showed multiple examples where he gave the switch yeah. to win based on unit sales. And here's the thing. No one argued with him nope. with dollar sales because I never argued that. You never argued that. None of us yeah. did. None of us ever went out PlayStation 1 MPD because it made the most money. In fact, that's usually not something we say about PlayStation, like, in general. Yeah. Like, we don't just say, oh, we made the more money. No. It's always been unit sales. Yeah. Don't, and then like... and, and this shit just changed out of the blue. And I'm like, holy shit, where did this? Like, I never seen that this gen, last gen, or any gen before that when it came yeah. to that. This is the first time. Like, yeah. like, yes, I seen, you know, they always talked about dollar sales, but they always also said which was the console that sold the most. And it's that's well, the winner. That well, never you, changed. You, you still haven't accepted the cold truth that Sony has made both those consoles irrelevant. And so they're trying to add in all this new stuff. <laughs> you just you said yourself, uh, this cat had no problem with it. Switch one. He didn't mention money. Mm -hmm. Money was off the table. But since it's Ill, since Switch is now becoming irrelevant, it's oh no, this counts. You know, we're like, who, 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 listen, who cares about the money, right? We already know Microsoft is the richest. Yes. Company. Yeah. We yeah, already it, know that that yeah, has yeah. not mattered because the richest company is damn near finna be in last place in, when it comes to gaming. I agree, but it's about so, relevancy at this point. It's about this. Just imagine a. Uh, a company, you know, I like a friend of mine works at McDonald Douglas, mm -hmm. and uh, you know, they're so they they do military contracts, and they don't want to lose some of these military contracts to Raytheon and and uh, all those guys. So they will go to the Pentagon and they will beg and they will plead and say, "We've done this, we've flown this." They're trying to stay relevant, you know. They'll, they'll talk about sorties that their planes flew five, six years ago, even though it's not relevant now. You know, but it, they're going to talk about it. It's it's all about becoming. It's just Sony has done such a good job. Even the press was banging on them. You know, crossplay stuff like that because there's nothing else to talk about. This has been a clean sweep. It was a tornado come through, and they they took everything off the board. There are no more moves left. None left. So they start bringing up money. You know, so and that's and they're going to start and it's going to get worse. I, I told people when a couple of weeks ago, I said, I'm not big on the gaming awards, but if if God of War or any Sony exclusive wins, they're going to go crazy. And ever since that win has happened, they have gone crazy. Just hey, nuts. That's, yeah, that's true. You know, just nuts lashing out, starting arguments. You know, it, remember I had you on J Dub, and I this that one cat was saying. I said, "Here's the side of the, uh, here's the Microsoft, uh, you know, the Microsoft store. Here's yeah. what they're saying 4K is." It said checkerboarded, native, and sparse rendering. Fair enough. They were just describing the way they were going to judge it. Yep. He, remember what that guy was saying? Oh, that doesn't matter. That doesn't count. Microsoft didn't say that. But it's on the Windows Central page. 
Oh, no, no, that's a misprint. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hey, I remember him saying that, man. It's just, yeah, yeah. It's the same yeah. thing with this cat, man. Yeah. Oh, this doesn't matter now because it's about the money. Because they're all afraid. Everybody's afraid of Phil Spencer walking out there, putting that one his is it his right hand, putting his right hand in his pan, and then saying we ain't got nothing. <laughs> Bye, go home. You know, and it's the same with Nintendo. Nintendo hey. gonna say we're just gonna sell in Japan. Hey, look, they, it's it's okay, man. They got E three coming. Yes. Uh, that that's I, I, that's supposed to be an automatic win for them, so it's it's you know it's, it's all good. I, I, I wonder what is coming for E three for Xbox because it's not going to be nothing from the new studios because they just got them. They just built they, them, yeah. it, the ones that do have something. It was games that they already had in development, so they're multi plats on PlayStation anyway. Yeah. And they're more more sixty eight rated games. So what are we, what are what are we what are we going to see from Xbox? Like like most of their stuff is. Is moves for next gen, you know, which, 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 like now we're seeing, you know, hardware talk on Anaconda and all that stuff. And I'm thinking, holy shit, like we you know, just barely got past Scorpio talk. Yeah. We <laughs> did, like, there was know. barely any room to talk about games. And now they're <laughs> back right into hardware, and like mm-hmm. five pieces of hardware and shit like that. I'm like, <laughs> yo, when is, when is it going to be dominated by talks of games, new franchises, and new. IPs and it's like we're not gonna get that for like two three years. Pretty much, they got uh, they got nothing else. So I mean, I agree with you, um, and they may show something. I hope they do. I'm just so happy that uh, the whole Halo thing has been put to rest. It is coming to PC. I'm excited. So uh, welcome. Not, not, wait, wait, wait. Not not that is is coming to PC. Mm. It's being built from the ground up for the PC. Oh yeah, and how about oh, my yeah. PC be here? Right? Oh yeah, that yeah, that definitely be a topic. We got that um Halo on PC, giving giving PC gamers the first class treatment. Mm. <laughs> that's what that's 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 their words. First class, yeah. <laughs> that's what that's their that's that that's what's interesting. It's it's Microsoft words. They're the ones saying it. Um, yeah, giving What's PC gamers the first mm. class treatment. Facts. Yeah, that's- shout out to uh, King's Blood for dropping that article. He's the first person I saw. Put that out because I wouldn't have known that had he not put that out there. <laughs> well, I put, I mean, I took a screenshot and um, mm-hmm. and I used yeah. it because somebody was talking about yeah. you know Halo Infinite. I'm like, and then I took a screenshot. I'm like, yeah, it's gonna be great on PC when I play it. Yeah. So you know, I, you know, my antagonizing ass. <laughs> 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 yeah, but that, honestly, that's why they're moving it. But remember, Porter Rock, you won the bet last year, mm-hmm. and the, the, the show where you had won. I forgot what one of those guys were saying because, like I said, they they like their biscuits buttery, but they were talking about the money. Look how much money Microsoft made. Everybody's doing good. That's yeah. that's the first time I can the, the attitude changed. Yeah. yeah, I agree. But they were talking about the money then. Oh, yeah, yeah. Money. Before that, it was like, oh, Xbox gonna dominate. It's new hardware, and everybody yeah. buys consoles because of power. Yeah, that yeah. changed real quick. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, I thought they would win December. So when Sony came out and announced they had pretty much stomped them in January, because January to me is the bigger NPD because you, that's for December. But when Sony, they and they, they won December by a bigger margin. And it was like, okay, they destroyed this beast before it even got out of its cage. This is done. You know, yeah. this is, this is, it was a non factor. So, but it has Assassin's Creed in 1080p 60. So, well, maybe that's yeah. something to take home. Shout out, shout out to D for that. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout out to him for that. I, like I said, it's got two little buttons on the front of it, though. Your, the Xbox does. I don't know if people realize that. So maybe you hit that button and something changes. I don't know. I call it the little bit more button. Now, hey, so. y'all remember when the, the the so-called Scorpio? The guys were saying it was going to have a screen on the front and the button so you can. <laughs> see how many frames and yeah. how many polygons, is, you know. <laughs> y- y'all don't remember that? Oh, I man. Remember that. It, yeah, like, <laughs> that was that was a dev kit. They're not gonna do that. This is supposed to be so powerful. 
Oh, it's man. a screen on the front. You hit the, oh, yeah, it shows the, the frames. Frames and, oh, my God. and resolution and all that. And it's like, oh. <laughs> Shout out to Raven Floyd. He says, uh, PC getting red carpet without paying for live. That's another. Yeah. That's uh, live is free on PC. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, when we get to that, I got. I got something to say about that. Yeah, mm, that's that's gonna. Yeah, that's this is somebody who's now entering the uh, my PC should knock wood. My motherboard should be here Sunday. I'm gonna take it up to that shop on Wednesday, and uh, hopefully by the 29th I'll have it. So if somebody new coming into PC, I got I got a lot to say about that. But I know mm -hmm. you're, we're gonna get to it. But uh, yeah, yeah, there's some challenges. Well, that'll be a good combo topic. Um, stuff like that. Um, I know next gen he's doing a live stream right now on Google, but he'll join us like in about 10 minutes or so. Yeah. Um, he's, he, you know, he's hurting after reading Halo's gonna get first class treatment on Xbox. You know, he's he's feeling some type of weight, you know. What I'm saying? I, I gotta ask people this because you can't have you can't have first class taste on multiple mm -hmm. devices. Somebody, somebody's gonna be the first suffer. class citizen, and everybody else is a peasant. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what does feel some kind of way What does feel because I hear people saying that. That's you remember that phrase? No, so feel these type of ways. Like, you know, it depends on the situation, but it's usually uh -huh. is usually um in a negative tone, meaning you're feeling other than happy. <laughs> and so yeah, that's what feeling you're you know, like something got you feeling some type of way, meaning you know. <laughs> You're in your field, or, or somebody tells me, "Oh, he's in his fields right now." Yeah, you know, you, you're either angry, sad. You know, you, there's something, something's bothering you. Mm -hmm. That's like somebody said, "Big mad or little mad." I'm like, yeah, okay. "What difference does it make? You're mad." Yeah, I mean, what kind of talk is this? Mm -hmm. And then some millennial would say, "I'm like, yep, yeah, had it come from a millennial." <laughs> <laughs> so, so I mean, how do you guys feel about that? That PC now is. It seems like PC is going to be the lead platform. Does that go back with a lot of guys were saying that Microsoft right now is, I mean, they've basically for a while been pushing people towards the PC. People telling me that it's all Xbox devices, that everything's all Xbox is a platform now. It's no longer just a console. It's a device. So if you decide to jump on PC, you're still jumping on Xbox. And I'm thinking, OK, yes. if it's all the same, then <laughs> how how is choosing one device? A superior choice over a factual superior choice over another Xbox device, and they're like, No, 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 it's not superior, it's just different. You know, you always gonna have counsel. I'm like, No, 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 I'm not talking about personal opinion on what you want to on what you want to choose. I'm talking factual options, like number one, all right, PC gets its own exclusives that don't come to the Xbox console to include Microsoft published games, right? Yep, you cannot tell me they're both the same device. <laughs> Yet one device gets more games than the other. Number yeah. two, you can install other options like Steam. You can install Steam on Xbox One. That's true. So how are they the same device when PC sure? does other things? Yeah, Xbox, I, you can install Steam and play right, Steam man. games. Yeah. Which is when you can play some... Craig, what are we doing, man? Hey, put, <laughs> man, what, yo, hey, man you know, know, this is a drug-free podcast. <laughs> <laughs> you got you to think of the children. Craig in well, I did have a couple of dogs. Yeah, I, I had a couple yeah, that of dogs. That Kentucky bourbon. Oh, you're sipping on wild turkey. Live on the air. What are we doing? Uh, yeah. <laughs> you see what well, I'm saying? So, so if they're yeah. the same, then how come you're not doing the same thing? Yeah. No, you know what, what it is, Porter Rock, I'm going to tell you what it is, right? These guys have compromised themselves as a gamer so hard. They've bent over backwards. <laughs> uh, to keep from taking an L, right? They they've bent over backwards so hard. Now it nothing matters anymore. It doesn't matter what Microsoft does, what they say, no matter how much they would hate it. I mean, come on, man! All their games are going any and everywhere. That and, and they're okay. They're happy with that. They're, <laughs> they're hyping up streaming and everything is is great. It's glorious. This is how how far we've come for the last five years. That means all those L's they have been taking. Uh, I mean, I mean, they. I think they just finally got beat up so much. They like they. They don't care. Let's let's just face it, right? I think they've kind of came came to the conclusion that they are just diehard Microsoft fans. Not even Xbox, but Microsoft fans. And there's nothing Phil can do, or anybody else at Microsoft can do that's going to change that. It's not about the games, right? Because this year they hadn't had the games. 
Uh, even <laughs> last year, they hadn't had the games. So let's let's stop with the. It's about the games because that that sixty eight template is not the way. Uh, <laughs> I, I, I think they've compromised that and they've kind of given up on that front. And now they're. I mean, they even gave up on this generation. They they don't even care now. They're like, well, we'll just wait to next generation once we get Scarlet and 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 the Anaconda and the four other consoles. It's to the <laughs> point now where these guys are okay and hyping up having four more consoles coming out. Yeah. That's how bad it is, Porter Rock. Mm -hmm. And so <laughs> this generation, you know, gamers bought three Xboxes. And next generation starting off, these guys are hyping up four consoles. So I, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I, I, I'm, 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 d I'm done. Uh, yeah, it sounds like Apple guys. I mean, this is what Apple. Like, if you talk to people who really love Apple devices, well, this is what they sound. They, they sound the same way. This is, you know, I had a conversation. I want first shout out to the super chat Raven Flow. Thank you so much for the support. He says MS took exclusives from PC and is giving them back. I think he's talking about like when the gen started. Uh, Microsoft's mission was to take the PC titles that PC gamers exclusively had. Yeah. And import them to the to the console space. That's why you started seeing U UWP, UWP, right? Remember yeah. that? Well, no, no, before that, we're talking before that. Like, like with the original Xbox, it had yeah. Marwin, and then oh, all yeah. of a sudden you saw Bioware games. You yeah. saw um, uh, what is it? Uh, the Jedi game, fucking um, uh, uh Knights of the yeah, Old Republic. Republic. Yeah, you know all I'm saying. You started seeing PC games coming to an Xbox, and that's because the leadership of Xbox at that time. They try to make the console look good. So it was about, hey, let's grab stuff from PC and try to put it on console so that way console gamers can have access to games they didn't have access to before. Yeah. And then on top of that, we're going to make Xbox console exclusive. We're, or not, not console exclusive, but Xbox exclusives, period. So it was a combination of let's try to get PC games onto the platform. Let's make our own exclusives, right? And then let's see if we could get these Sony exclusives and make a multi -plats. That was a company that looked at Xbox as a console, and this is the priority. This is what we need to sell. We need to make this one specific device look great to gamers, and gamers will flock to it. And that was a strategy, you know, that started with the OG Xbox, and it continued with the Xbox 360. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It was getting PC games, keeping exclusives exclusive to Xbox, and try to get more multi-plats. From PlayStation brand, so that way people can't say, "Well, you know, Xbox looks great, but you know, I'm a Final Fantasy fan, I gotta play it on PlayStation, or I'm a Grand Theft Auto fan, so I gotta get a PlayStation." You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Peter Moore engineered that. He prevented people from still getting PlayStation because they had to play Grand Theft Auto Four, or they had to play Final Fantasy, or they had to play Devil May Cry. Like, yeah. you know, any little excuse that a PlayStation fan would have on why to stay. On PlayStation, he took that away. That's true. That's a that's a dude that said, "Come by my console. We're gonna be the best at it." You know, yep. every little thing. He didn't say, "Well, well I'm gonna take away stuff from from Xbox mm -hmm. and move it over to PC and other devices." You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That way, you can play wherever the hell you want. Now, I get it as a philosophy. That sounds like great, great for gamers or whatever. But to me, what's great for gamers is competition. It's yeah. the attitude of. These motherfuckers are doing what? Oh, fuck you. We're going to do it too. We're going to do it better. Is, is that not what Trophy is? Yep. Trophy was simply Microsoft is doing what? Oh, mm -hmm. fuck you. We're going to do the same thing and yep. we're going to try to do it better. I mean, that's really what it is. Microsoft saw Sony does what? Sony got communities? Mm -hmm. Oh, fuck you. We're going to do clubs and we're going to try to do it better. That That's, that's mm -hmm. what I like about consoles. Yep. They go back and forth, right? Trying to one up each other, and they end up doing things that become a standard template in gaming. Like, remember, it was Microsoft that started Xbox Live. Sony saw that as a competitive threat, and they're like, Man, we gotta do our own shit, right? Yep. So we gotta yeah, have yeah. our own unified friends list, we gotta have voice chat, we gotta have party chat. Now, these things aren't known as Xbox Live, they're just pretty much a standard template in gaming. Mm -hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. That's what competition between like the many of the things we enjoy today were competition between consoles. Yeah. To one up each other, you know? Yeah. True. And, so, and that and that's going away. And if that goes away, what quality products do we get? We don't. We don't. Because none of the core products are built with competitive nature in mind.
Yeah. And not built with the idea of we have to be better than someone else. Yeah. And I and and, and that's the dangerous thing part. That's the dangerous part of it, Porter Rock, is once the competition stops, there's no incentive to do that. Then then the only thing is left is whoever has the cheapest it microtransactions and loot crates and all kind of other stuff to make <laughs> money. Yeah. Because people right now are hyping up profits. And I've I've never seen this ever in my life. When it comes to gaming, I've never seen people care about how much Sega made or how much that 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 had yeah. nothing to do with us, especially right. for a company that has all the money yeah. and is not giving you the games. Yeah. So I, I just really I'm puzzled about it. You know, I, I I hate dealing with money when it comes to these corporations because it does not benefit at, yeah. at, at all. At least we've seen the proof is in the pudding, right? Yeah, uh, I know guys are saying, well, the the more money they make, the more they're going to invest. Well, how, how do you do that when you have the world's richest company uh, that start. didn't didn't invest for three years? Um, so <laughs> how, how, how do you justify that? Are you going to say, OK, well, they're going to invest now and it's going to be OK? It's like, yeah, but they're they've chose a whole different path. They're not on that path anymore. Yeah. And this is what scares me is the, the mere fact that what if next generation, right? Okay, they 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 bought they bought these studios. They're gonna make games. Uh, the reason why Microsoft is in a position that they're in now and why they've changed everything is because their base did not buy the games, in in yeah. in, the, in in the first place. You know, if the, if the guys would have bought the games, we wouldn't be in this position. We wouldn't even be having this. Well, you couldn't blame them. Like, like no, I said, we we I, look I at it. hindsight. I, look at the games they released. I, I, I get it. I get it, Porter Rock. Like right? I, I, I get it. But here's, <laughs> but here's the thing: people right? are not gonna buy that game. How many people right now are begging for Rise 2? How many yeah. people now are begging for like like 20 time? people? Nah, I, I, but I mean it's I mean think I, about it, it's the same people. It's, it's <laughs> not a lot, it's not a lot. It's yeah. not like God of War. Like God of War, I see like insane amount of randoms just come out of nowhere yeah. talking about yeah. God of War. They never talk about PlayStation. Like you look at that timeline, they don't talk about PlayStation at all. Yeah. Then all out of the blue, man, this God of War game is great. Like, whoa, shit, where you come? That was a great game. I had never played a God of War game before with that. I know. That, believe that, me, we know. After yeah. the last yeah. podcast, you asked why <laughs> why yeah. Kratos was God of War and not not all. <laughs> I'm thinking we we knew we were like what the Craig what is this guy doing? Yo, shout well, out to Carlos. Like I said, I mean, not to reiterate it, but everybody needs to go back and watch Wonder Woman. She fights yeah. the God of War. And and someone needs not. to go play God of War One. <laughs> <laughs> yo, shout out uh, to well, Carlos Fernandez. What? I mean, <laughs> yo, I, mean, I, mean, a, I mean, I think it was a cool nickname for somebody, but uh, yeah. yeah, I can understand why he was a God of War because he beat up Thor's family. You know, I don't, you know, I'm like, bye. Yeah, you gotta see God of War War. Shout out to Carlos Fernandez. Thank you for Super Chat. He said, Xbox do not com compute common. I also do not compute common sense. No, they don't. And he also <laughs> another shout out. Um, He said, Microbots can't analyze common sense math or want to be NASDAQ master degree bozos. Damn, these guys are <laughs> rough. My stock guy, you know, was K. Megan, was quoting stock prices. So I tried to hire him. Oh, he, no, he didn't. Man. Didn't tweet me back, oh, so man. <laughs> I mean, I'm just you know, hey, if he can do well, my, you know, my my trade cheaper, fair enough, I'm all for it, you know. <laughs> yeah. So, so, so what, right? Next generation start, let's say, uh, 2020, January 2020, clean slate. What if the guys still don't buy the games then? Then what? Well, <laughs> they, they don't, they're on Game Pass. Yep. Okay. So, not gonna buy the games. I mean, it's, this is crazy. Like me, I'm, I'm gonna try out Crackdown, but I'm not buying it. Like to be honest, mm -hmm. I can't. I can't for the right of me. Like Ashen, I'm gonna play Ashen. You know, once I get through this boring ass Red Dead and shit, right? I can't for the life of me justify buying Ashen when I could play it for ten bucks. Like yeah. I just can't do it. Like they'd be like, Puerto Rock, are you retarded? Why would you pay? You know, this is this no. is like, you know, this, I'm not Dr. Evil. Why pay a game for ten dollars when you can pay sixty? Like, I'm not gonna do that. Like yeah. uh, Microsoft, and it's not my fault. Microsoft is literally, you know, telling you to do it. Telling, telling me to do it. Yeah, like they're literally selling me the game for 10 bucks. Yeah, so I'm gonna do it. So yeah. I'm gonna go pay 10 bucks for one month, play the game. If I like it, I'm gonna keep paying it until I beat it. After I'm done beating it, unsubscribe because I'm not just gonna let it sit there and collect ten dollars month after month. <laughs> yeah, and then when Crackdown comes around, I'll resubscribe, pay my ten dollars, play Crackdown single player. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm gonna do back and forth. Mm -hmm. I'm just not gonna let it stay subscribed because who God knows how long the next good game might come out. You yeah. know? 
And I and I don't care about paying ten dollars month to month to play three sixty games and shit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I, I, you, you, I mean, it, that's common sense, right? Mike, Phil, and all those guys are telling you, don't buy our games. Go, just get them on Game Pass. That's basically what they're saying. And, and I know some people. Some people make the argument, oh, you can still buy the games. I'm like, yes, you still can. Just like if McDonald goes, hey, you could get a Big Mac for two dollars if you, you know, buy six piece nuggets, right? Yeah, you can still. Buy the Big Mac separately for eight dollars, but why would you? Yeah, just get the nuggets, and now you got everything for two bucks. Yes, you can still choose it, but the guy in the register will look at you like you're retarded, yeah. and they'll be like, "Okay, here you go, nine ninety five with no nuggets and yeah. an extra dollars." <laughs> but if that's what you want, that's fine. Like we're not gonna argue with you. Like yeah. you know, we offering you the sell. You know, all you had to do was cut out a coupon. That's all you had to do. But you just don't want to cut the coupon, then don't. Just but put, put, the put a rock. All right. So that nine ninety nine for Game Pass, right? There, there has to be a way, and and, and I, I think you know, in the future they're going to have to raise that price, right? How, how can they keep continuing on with, you know, like I got Game Pass for whenever they come out with new games like Crackdown or whatever, I'll get Game Pass. You know, hold on. I'll play for a month and then, I, and then I'll cancel my subscription. Before you ask that question, we'll, we'll, we'll start merging this conversation with the PS Now because it applies to PS Now as well. It's, yes, the same, yes. it's the same thing. But first, shout out to Ruham. Um, he said, what's good? PR77 and the panel was good, brother. Thank you for hey, showing man, up. What's up. Hope what's you up, enjoyed man? the show. Soon we're going to have Zaire. He's going to bear his soul. You know, he confused, <laughs> he confused a Crackdown 3 single player for a Crackdown 1 enhancement game. Um, <laughs> Carlos Fernandez, he says, you need an English dictionary to define multi-platform 2, Puerto Rock. Them D-Batch clones are on the rise. Assassin's Creed 1080p 60, yo. It, we're oh, almost 2019, yeah. and people still don't know what an exclusive multi-plat means. It's, it's, mm-hmm. it's, I saw you put that up there. I can't, I'm bro. Like, I'm not dealing with that. I'm like, it's whatever. If you, I, I, I mean, I'm not dealing with it. It's, it's so not that, anything but PlayStation yeah. means exclusive. Yeah. Like well, that's the, that, that is the dumbest definition. Like, because for example, is Red that exclusive? Because since it's not on Switch and PC, right? Or is it a multiplayer? Right. Like, right. where is this fine line? Like, this is so stupid. I, this argument. But then you realize they're re, they're trying to relitigate things. People were bringing up 2013 to me oh. this past week. They were like, PlayStation did. Yo, you all act like 2013 through 2015 never happened. That's what somebody said. I'm like, what are you talking about? Because they they shouldn't have no games. I'm like, here's the problem. Here's the problem with that, right? Anytime they bring that up, I keep asking them, why do you keep saying that? Because the mere (laughs) fact that even in 2013 through 2015, when PlayStation didn't have any games, y'all was still losing. You still was losing the NPD and you were still losing the sales. So why didn't have big blockbuster games? That's what I'm telling people. Like nobody really had big exclusives at the start of launch. Yeah. You know, so that's no one really. It was fucking kill zone versus (laughs) rise, and they're rising. Like, no one wanted that shit. Like, none of those games, like the one true game people wanted on Xbox. Was Halo Five right? And it wasn't even Master Chief, and it came out in October 2015. It was like two years. Yeah. I think right away but then, didn't PlayStation have like a Street Fighter game in 14, and then MLB the Show? Well, and- uh, Street Fighter was 15. Yeah, 15, 15, 15, okay. 15 was when everything really was started moving. I mean, there was Infamous yeah. in 2014, you know. Uh, but yeah, everything, everything was really that. popping at 15. The gen started really once, get going once at 15. Bloodborne hit, that's when Bloodborne in 15. Popping. That's yeah. when it started yeah, popping. That's what, yeah. that's what I'm saying. Once Bloodborne hit, yeah. it was on. It, it was on. Grand opening. Grand oh, oh, shit, man. Man. Oh, man. Man. oh shit, my man, my man, my man, my man's about to confess his son, his sins. My man out here, <laughs> all, yo, Puerto Rock, you saw Crackdown One X and Hence. I'm like, yo, G, oh, that's shit. Crackdown Three. Oh, he like, oh shit, oh my god, man, I gotta go check. He said, like, I gotta go to the Xbox. <laughs> hey, he said, Phil, crack, forgive me. Yeah. No, not yet, not yet. We're gonna get there. We're gonna, we're gonna talk about the goal. I'm glad you're here. Yo, 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 that motherfucker fighting the bush match. The bush was the bush match at the end. I don't know what the <laughs> fuck going on. Yo, we're gonna talk about <laughs> PS Now. You know, PS Now now coming to Xbox One. PS Now on every device. All right. Um. So we saw the listing. We saw the job opening. Right. Uh. Before that, Ravenflow fight out. He says step one. You know, fight out super chat. He says step one, get an Xbox. Step two, get Game Pass. Step three, download gears for 10 bucks. Step four, beat the game. Grand finale, unsubscribe. 
grand opening, grand closing. <laughs> you know that you all you know I'm on my fuck shit. I do that shit every time. Oh shit, new game. Subscribe for 10 bucks, beat it, unsubscribe. Deuces. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, anyway, with this PS now, let's talk. Let's talk about PS now. Let's get let's get in the store. So Sony had this recruitment video, right? Mm -hmm. Trying to get people on their team. You know, they're saying, hey, we got a great team. But in the video, damn, I have my notes. One of the big key points they said was the project team is fairly small managing a large infrastructure, right? Yeah. yeah. So it would seem they have the infrastructure. They just didn't have the people Stand. to manage it, right? So okay. that, so that's possibly the, the actual real reason why they cut so many devices of PS Now. Remember, you know, Z was playing fucking God of War on the Samsung TV and shit, yep. you know? So they cut all that and they limited to just PlayStation and PC. So based on this recruitment video, it sounds like it's because they just didn't have the people to, to manage the influx that having, you know, PS Now on so many devices would bring. So mm -hmm. they cut it, they, 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 they scaled it back to probably what they could handle, right? Now it seems like they want to hire more people to push it out on every device, right? Okay, so now, number one, do you feel Sony, and we'll go down the line, is trying to adopt Microsoft strategy to where they'll eventually put their games day one? Or do you think PS Now is um, kind of like a side chick where, yeah, we're going to put on every device, but honest. you're not, hold up. Like it's okay. gonna be on every device, but oh. you're not gonna get the first class treatment of the console because you're not gonna get the day one games. Um, like if you choose PS now, you a side chick. Now here's the thing. I'm gonna be What's honest up? with you, real talk, right? Mm -hmm. Without waiting my contract. I I if Sony was smart, it's basic business one on one, right? Because at the end of the day, I mean, how you say men lie, numbers lie, numbers don't lie. Yeah, we tease Microsoft about you know the lack of software, just that and the other, or what you know, just well, the game's been dogs the last two and a half, three years. You know what I mean? And with the offerings that they have here now, it's getting a little better now. You know what I mean? As far as content. Um, but I, I think it would be ingenious to Sony to day, you know, day and date. Because again, you know, now everybody wants a monthly bill, regardless whether it's Netflix, whether it's just that and the other, or whatever. You know what I mean? It's not for everybody, but such as myself, I was signed up for it. You know, I mean, you know, fifteen dollars a month, whatever, and I get to play their exclusive thing and date. And I probably, with some games, I might still double dip just for the collector's edition, just for the, you know, just for the culture. You know what I mean? Uh, but I believe so. You know what I mean? It, especially like I said, you know, I don't know the numbers. Microsoft could be lying, but it's been successful for them thus far. You know You're lying eyes. You know what I mean? That's what they're saying. You know what I mean? You know, sales are forty percent on some older titles, whatever the case may be. I just thinking again, yeah. it would be ingenious for Sony to do so. I'm just talking about. I'm not even. I'm not even talking about. I'm not even. I'm thinking. I'm not even talking about PlayStation now on every device. That, yeah. I'm, not talking about. I'm just talking about just on your console, the service that you can get the exclusive day and date. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Just we're gonna leave it at that right now. Right yeah. Day and date because Game Pass and X Cloud two different, totally different things. Yeah. Game Pass, you pay ten bucks a month or whatever it costs a month. You get a, you know, uh, access to those titles. X Cloud lets you take your digital library with you. That's no money. That's just what it is. It is what it is. You know what I mean? Um, so that's two different things. But again, for that, in my opinion, for this thing to grow and really take off, and seeing, you know, it, it, I had an article. You had left. Uh, I think Neff found the article. Oh, somebody had post. Somebody had the article. I think by the time you had left. Uh, where they're looking to make more money because we, we, we all think of Sony again as a hardware company, right? Yeah, they gave a um, it's you know been successful with them, but they had one of their meetings or something. I'll put on me now, but uh, you might just, Jay, I don't know if you was did you do that show? You know, you didn't do the show, but anyway, I'm saying that they're going to start looking more into services is where they make the, the, the bulk of their money from mm -hmm. the services. Mm -hmm. I mean. And again, a lot of us old school guys may like frown upon it, like, hey, you know, mainstream, this, that, and the other, or whatever. You know, I'm just saying, but we're put around sad to say we are the, we're the dying regime. You know what I mean? Yeah. You have a whole bunch of up and coming new gamers, don't give a fuck about none of that. They just want to have access to it. You know what I mean? And, yeah. you know, how you say we still have two billion, whatever million gamers. And I think for every company, you know, because they do make their money on software, that's the, you know, mm -hmm. you know, but I, I think so. What about going forward? Yeah. Uh, here's the thing, right? Uh, uh, and I, I'm going to disagree. Just because these companies want to make money and, and there's a way to make money, that does not mean that they don't know 
uh, their base and that they don't know how to continue on uh, with making their base happy. Um, and I get it. A lot of people say money talks, bullshit walks. What do you, you got to realize? Base? Right, they're, they're, Sony is in a whole different ball game and whole different space than Microsoft. Sony can't afford right to piss off its fans, its base, the ones who bought a hundred million consoles to try some bullshit on that they have already said <laughs> they didn't want. Right? Hey, wait, hold on. <laughs> People said that they didn't want fucking PS now and they didn't give a shit about it. Hey, so wait. why would you double and triple and quadruple down and do hey, that? Wait. Now now you're just poking the poking the bear. Hey, wait, here's the thing though. Put, put me a G though. Listen, here, right? Yeah. Remove yourself. You know, listen, here's the thing. You gotta step outside the lines, right? That's true. That's true. I right, uh, step outside the box, right? Yeah. Now, what shot PS and gonna be on? What shot PS now in the foot at the start of the generation was the pricing was horrible. Yeah, the pricing was horrible. They were charging 20 bucks for games like Ben yeah. 10, like yeah. three hours. I mean, that was the, the pricing, and yes. it didn't work. Now you're talking about you down, they told, now they're talking about let you download the games here, you know, yeah. your, play and play them native. It's to, totally two different things, you know what I mean? And far as the base or whatever, who they're you not know if you don't want it, you don't have to buy it. This is all yeah. like, like I was telling crap with them last year, you before last, about the X and the Pro. If you don't want it, he said, We got a console for you, you don't have to buy it. Yeah. If you don't want to get the service, you don't have to. No problem. You can still go out and buy the games for those that don't want to have, you know, you know, I, you know what's that? Uh, like back in the spring, though, know, somebody put out the Yakuza, this step back to back to back. I mean, you know, you may not have it all. You can get just ten bucks a month. You know, I mean, you can't try some of this greatness, fuck nigga. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm gonna act like I'm doing an unboxing. Try some of this, fuck, some of this greatness. I, I get right. I'm the I'm in the minority. I get it. You know what I'm saying? I I I totally get that. So you get pissed off if this was but do you actually think right? I'm just saying. <laughs> Do you actually think <laughs> the these, ca right. these casuals, uh, right, are really gonna walk around with a fucking control in their pocket and their iPad? Hey, listen, you're talking about two different things now. Trying to play, trying to play these games, like. Hey, 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 Jay, no, you blurring the lines. We just talking about PS now. Dave, we just talking about. I'm not talking about playing anywhere. Yeah, yeah. I'm just talking about for this service yes, to now. take off. Yeah, yeah. I'm just talking about football. I ain't talking about playing anywhere. Okay, That's okay. coming. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. All right. Got you. Let's say before God of War came out, right? This okay. is the game that you was your most anticipated game. Yes, year, sir. Right? You've been yes, talking sir. about it way before, right? Yes, sir. Let's say that motherfucker would have came out on PS Now, you know, day oh. and date on PS Now. Okay. Would you have not bought it for the PS4? And just yeah, the boy. I got it. Now. I got well, it. he would he he would have bought it for collectors, but most people, I got I got most people, console. I got the collector's yeah. edition. Yeah, like most, like me, like me. If Sony, if Sony were to announce day and day game, the game was still gonna sell. No, no, but, but it's not gonna sell as much though. It's gonna drop. Uh, listen, here, 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 even because let's say if Sony yeah, announced, if Sony announced day and date. You know, let's say, right, let's say pretty, let's say pretty much PS now is no I different than PS4. I will subscribe to it and then that's it. I will okay, pay my 10 bucks this? a month. Listen to this though, right? And I wouldn't buy okay, PlayStation. Okay, listen, 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 listen. I want you to think about this, right? At the end of the day, whether you subscribe to the service mm -hmm. or whether you buy the game, who does, who money is they going in who pocket? I, I get it. I get it. I, I get I that. Get but it. remember, I, I mean, I get that. Sony still gets the money, right? But you have to look at it this way. And this is why I was telling y'all the math. Three days of Spider-Man sales. Hell, three days of Spider-Man sales. And I just said three days. That's all. And three days of God okay. of War sell made more money than an entire year of okay. Game Pass with two million subscribers. And, that, and again, I just stopped that three days. I guarantee right now it's going to take Game Pass or even PS Now right. two to three years to catch uh, up uh, on what Spider-Man uh, and God of War did the whole year just by themselves. We got the, the, the X variable, right? Those games take how long to develop? Four to five years. Yeah. So you take again game. So again, you got game. You got God of War in in, in PS now, yeah. and you sell it for year one, <laughs> year two, year three, year four, year five until you drop the next one. What are you talking about? Wait, say that again. You said that God of War. And, and, so how many copies? Whatever copies. How many days? Right. Yeah. Okay. Fine. And so That's, so so three million right. three days. Okay, see, say 60 million, whatever retail take. Say, 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 you said 180 million. This same piece. Sony. Say, say, if Sony. That's 360 I, million between the two of them. Game Pass okay. ain't making that money. PS Now's okay. not making that money. Listen, okay, I'm, 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 I'm going to have fun with this. So, yeah. that's, and say, if you got PS Now, right? Look at yeah. this. And you got 80 million. What's, what's, what's the PS Plus numbers at? 
PS Plus numbers is at thirty five million. Okay, thirty five million, right? Yeah. Now you say if you take out of thirty five million, you're gonna say we're gonna we're gonna play it small here. Yeah. You're gonna say five million or six million to sign up for the service at ten bucks a month. All right? How many? Now how long? Uh, listen, how often do you get a God of War every th- three to four years? Hello, yeah. Yo Z, where's he? Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Okay, go ahead. Yeah, yeah. You get a, you get a, you get a God of War every three to four years, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So that little you talking about short money? You keep on the ball here. That little too much you made in two or three days or whatever the fuck you talking about? You making that type of money for three to four fucking years? Mm-hmm. That's what they're banking on the long money. You talking about the short money? We're no. Talking about the long money. No, yeah, but you don't understand what they I'm saying is money. Listen, hold on. they will make more money on the stick. Just tell you on no, the they service, won't, man. Because think about it, the service is being think about it. The service is being split. Because, is that true? Listen, Six hold on. no, listen, <laughs> no. But I'm giving you details. The service is split between hundreds of games. All those shits got to get a cut. God of War just did it by itself, and now add in MLB the Show by itself, add in Detroit by itself, add in the multiplast that sell huge. By it, so look at Red Dead. Red Dead probably sold so six, seven is, million on the PlayStation by itself. So well. your, theory, your theory is that again, I'm th- Sony said this, so they make more money off the services, right? Not again. No, they so, were no Sony, Sony makes more money off the software sales, but direct so, I mean, at sixty bucks a pop. Well, they make, make these companies make more money off services. Period. But you got to listen. You put it right. You got to look like this, right? No, I, I think I think Microsoft makes more money off of Microsoft the, makes probably makes more got. services because no, everything they don't have PlayStation. PlayStation is the opposite. PlayStation is the opposite. What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Sony's big, but big, 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 making most money from them right now is what software sales. Direct, direct software sales. Direct software sales. PlayStation Plus. All the microtransactions. All the VC points, all this, all that. But hold on, microtransactions. Wait, hold on. Microtransactions is a is a result of game sales. Not PlayStation Plus. No, game sales. You, you got to sell the games before you can. Yeah, play. You, that's what I'm saying. It's the, it's the game sales. It's the game sales, man. Game, game, wait, I'll give you an example. Listen, what, hold on. What's good? What's good? What okay. What makes PSN Plus good if you don't sell games? No one would have it. Okay, listen. All right. It's the me. game oh, sales. Oh, oh, okay, that's listen. the heart of everything. Okay, listen. Everything. Right. This is this is. Oh, think about it. Everything. I'm saying. Hold on. Everything revolves around the game sales. You got to have games. If you have the games, then people will flock. To your services, no okay. games, no services. Because what are you yeah, servicing? Yeah, 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 say, say it again. You, if you had the what? What you gotta have the games, and they, and people will do what? And then people will flock to the services so based on the games. What I'm saying? No, you're saying it's the services that you're making the money from. No, it's the games. Games no, 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 is what's doing it all. No, here's the thing. Again, I'm gonna say this again. If they had the games inside the service, people will sign up for the service. Mm-hmm. But they're I'm, already, yeah, but they're already selling the game. They would make more money. How? Don't know. When you're losing 60 bucks. It's like saying you'll make more money selling a game for $10 than $60. How? The game is not going to sell. So everybody, let's say, let's, say, let's, say, let's, say, let's say like this, right? Yeah. No one's going to buy Blu-rays because you got Netflix. Well, no Blu-ray, Blu-ray, Blu-ray sales is actually because, going down. Because they got Hulu. Yes, actually, Blu-ray sales is going down because of that. Okay, so again, this sales is that not the the not what happened to music and whatever? Everything's going down because of that. Yeah, when it, oh, think, about it, 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 think about 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 it this way, think, think, think about it this way. I know, but no, they didn't stop buying music. Okay, so it went down. But think of think of not as much as before. Why you think they're doing all this fuck shit in the music industry? They're not. They, so, you so go you look at it. So think see, it, think about it this way. See, you're telling me you pay ten dollars a month, and with that ten dollars, yes. right, you're playing yes. Spider Man, God of War, yes. Detroit, MLB the Show, and somehow right. Sony's making more right. money. Yeah. On yeah. top of that, money. Call of Duty, Red Dead, um, right, so um Monster Hunter. Hunter. Wait, 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 Sony, Sony's making about, more no, money no, 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 with ten dollars no. a month. So now you're taking it across. We're talking about their places now and what it is. Yeah. I said Sony's putting their exclusives. I ain't talking about third party. I'm talking about their shit into a service. I ain't talking about nobody else. I'm talking about their. They will make more money, absolutely. Absolutely. I'm not talking about so. Monster Hunter, none of this other shit. You ain't got that shit in Game Pass. I'm talking about their own shit. Yes, absolutely. They will make more money. You know why? At the end of the day, because there's so many gamers out there that's not going to buy Spider Man. Yeah, not buy but, God of War. but that's, that's when not you going to buy. But, yeah, I know, but that's when, when but that's, but that's when you put the games a year or two after no. the service is out. 
Listen, I'm because you me. because listen, the, the key is when I you tell, listen, when, when you sell when you sell the game you day one, price. you're gonna get the sales. When you put when you put out Spider Man two, that motherfucker's gonna sell. It's gonna yeah. fucking sell. It's, it's gonna it's sell it's consoles. It. Now, two years later, think, think about it, two years later, no one's yeah. really gonna buy Spider Man no more. It's pretty much that's it. You know, hey, it, hey, time hey, is not. You sell like the defense. You, you worry about you worry about Sony's pockets? Or what no. What would happened? you sign up with the service? No, 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 listen, listen, like, listen. Would you sign up for the service? Oh, no, no, hold up, hold up. What? Would you I'll sign up for the service? Yeah, I will sign up for the service. Okay. But listen, I'm not arguing whether I'm going to sign up for service. I'm just saying, okay. right? If Sony decides it, that's on them, you know? But if I'm telling you, if I'm a businessman, if I'm looking at it from a business perspective, I'm going to sell my games direct sales first exclusively. Because I know I'm gonna get my sixty dollars, and then after like let's say two years, when the shit died down, then I'm gonna put it on PS Now and get the remainder of the people that will not buy my game day one or whatever. Here's about this, right? That's how I would do as a businessman. Now, if no, Sony, no now listen, I'm not fighting against it. I'm not. That's not what I'm trying to do. If Sony does it, then I'll sign up for the service. Now I get to play the next God of War for ten dollars. It ain't, I mean, it ain't they, my choice. They're they not making less money because, yes, but by the by that same thing, because someone doesn't have the money. You can get it from red box people still gonna play it they're gonna play it mm. my thing is but again you have uh, see yourself you have 80 million people right you, you might just give an example you have uh you said you have ps plus right is what 35 million yeah there's no way there's, there's no places in schools that sold 35 million right we can agree with that right there's no one there's no game that sold 35 yeah, million period besides we have to hold a five but okay great besides that maybe so, Okay. Yeah. No, so it's over seven million, whatever. Fuck, some crazy. Yeah, but that's across everything. Okay. Too. But saying, but yeah. I, I said to say this though, right? Okay. Um, I said to say this. So you have a game like you say Uncharted Four or The Last of Us Two, right? Yeah. And Uncharted Four, you can spend money and do all types of kits and just that and the other, right? Mm -hmm. All right. So I get to play that game. No, I like this game. I like the service. You know what? Now I'm gonna spend twenty bucks in this game. So that game is continually to make money. You have a bigger install base, more player pools. You know what I mean? And again, I, I and you say for yourself, I don't see this as a bad thing. I don't keep, you know, man, you can, we can go back to who sells what, but the game, if a game is great, the game is going to sell regardless, regardless is whatever the fuck the case may be, it's going to sell. I'll give you an example, right? Right now on Project Scheme, Stream, uh, Google Stream, you get to play Assassin's Creed Odyssey for free. Did that stop that game from charting month after month in NPD? No. And you can play them right now for free. Yeah, What's but no one cares about game streaming. You telling me people care about game streaming right now? No one cares uh, right now. Yeah, that shit works. I'm, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm game? not. I'm not a arguing. Game? I'm not arguing that it works. I'm arguing. Do people free. even care? I'm saying, do people even care? No I one cares. Do. I think no one cares. Care. There's only really the hardcore guys who are testing it out it's that are playing free. it. Most, bro, but but most. Free. I understand, but who's actually on it? Are they, is there like twenty million people on it right now? I don't know the numbers. It's, most, I, it's mostly the I hardcore. Just, it's mostly the hardcore gamers I right now know. testing it out, and most and of I, it do YouTube videos about it. I, I, I think it's no one's really on it. Most people, I guarantee now, you ask the average person who's playing Assassin's Creed, and you tell them, "Hey, you know Google Stream has this." They're gonna be like, "What the fuck is Google Stream?" Um, I just say, I, I, I just, most people better. don't even know about it yet. You say, you say, you say the minority, right? Or the, right. the hardcore, right? What would you contribute to be the hardcore? They know about it. The what? The okay. ones who are into tech, like you, okay. me. Okay. They are diehard into tech. All right. So you average say, what, gamer, I guarantee the average gamer don't even know okay, fine. who's even doing anything. Not a problem. So you say about two million people. A million. People I, I don't even. I don't even think that much. A hundred thousand or whatever. That's not a lot of game. Mm -hmm. Again, that is what I'm saying. A free copy of the game. Right. Yeah. It's still going to charge. That again, a totally different audience. You got some people that where they consume their media, media is you know, this or whatever the fuck. Then again, we talk about a free goddamn game. I mean, it's, it's on a charge because charge. most people are not playing the free version, most people don't even know it exists. That's what I'm trying to say. If everybody, even right down to the average consumer, right? The average gamer, the gamer that don't follow our channels, whatever. If they all find out they could play these games for ten dollars, you're going to see the direct sales drop. Because uh, there's no incentive to them for the and I'm not arguing that a company shouldn't do this. That's not what I'm saying. All I'm saying is sales will drop. Now, if these companies are banking that despite these sales dropping, they're still gonna make more money, then that's on them. But if it doesn't work, the industry is gonna hurt for for a move that I don't think is that necessary for gaming to evolve and grow. 
You understand uh, what I'm saying? Because here's my thing. Everybody's saying we're the old dinosaurs, right? I heard the same I, I, shit. I, 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 hold up. I heard the same shit okay. with, the, with the Wii. I heard the same exact bullshit in 2006. No, you know, no, but listen, you weren't around. You, you weren't around before 2012. Yeah. I heard the same exact hey, shit around? in 2006. Hold on, let me finish. Okay. In 2006, when the Wii came out, people were telling me gaming has to involve. We need new controls. Look All at right. the cells of the Wii. Look at the cells of the game. Look at the low cells of the ps3 if 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 gaming needs to survive they have to go the Wii route and i was telling people those motherfuckers nintendo's catering ring to that is a fad to them they will not be there for the next gen i guarantee nintendo will not have the same exact system because they're not going to be interested in it and lo and behold the same thing happened they're trying to cater to a fan base that is faddish here today gone tomorrow right, that's who they are right. All right, so we, we say you say we, no, we let me say, do some super chats real quick. So we got time for princess. Thank yeah. you so much for the super chat. Appreciate it, girl. Um, thank you all for rocking out with us. Shout out everybody in the chat. You know, it says everybody in the chat, man. Hit the like button. You know what I'm saying? Oh shit, my shit stuck. Okay, well, dang, we get we get mad motherfuckers up here. God damn. Uh, who else we got? Who else we got? Uh, god damn, motherfucker, this shit's flowing like a motherfucker. Ding, ding. I'm sorry about that. Okay, next is Harry Heck. You know, straight from you know, straight from Europe. He goes, Red Dead Redemption Two is a great example on expand the profit margin on AAA blockbuster games by release them later on other platforms, like release God of War on PS Now in 2020. And then we also got Harry again. He said Microsoft hasn't has having the luxury of those AAA games. You know, yeah, because their game is dog shit. Uh, Raven Flow. He says, Z, the more consoles sell, the more games we get. I'll at your boy. You know, Z, Z, Z's losing faith, man. You know what I'm saying? He's been hanging around around fucking now. Now we now we got these streaming fanboys like me and shit. Now he's fucking up my boy. You know, you, you know, you yo, you hanging out with the wrong people. Crap was right. You're hanging out with the wrong people. <laughs> you heard crap said that shit. Yo, you 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 surrounding yourself with the wrong people. Yo, my man Warrior. Yo, I got shout out to Warrior. He says we are all on sinking ships. Both companies are looking at this strategy for a reason. He says, hey, 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 yo, yo, we we both on the Titanic. Hey, yo. Like, uh, without uh, without the violin group, hold on, hold on. Hey, Raven flow. Oh, Z <laughs> is saying player volume over individual unit sales, and then let's see where we at with the uh, with the final mentions. Uh, my man Carlos Fernandez. He says exclusive sales, game oh, game services, lost profit over a spread margin that ain't checkers. Z look at game flight stream service. Them lying eyes and shit. Yeah, I think I think post ups in this motherfucker. Is yeah, he is he working and shit? Yeah, I'm, I'm, well, I mean, I'm send him a link. See if he hops on. I mean, you all are not understanding that Microsoft with Game Pass created a sustained revenue stream. That's what they needed to do. Yeah. Now, I don't know how much it is, line, but line, that was very important. Line, line OB, so, Z, how many people will go to the movies if movies drop day one on Netflix and DVD? I, I the, reason, would, the, yeah. reason, the reason why Netflix thrives with their own series because they keep the budget low and get older movies. Mr. Uh, Parker was good. Panel was good uh, with you. Here's, here's the thing: we're gonna have fun with this. We're gonna cut, no, it, no, up. Let me, let me, we're gonna cut it up. Here's the thing: I'm, not, I'm Z. I'm a side with you, right? I'm a side with you. Oh, right? no, let me. I'm we, 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 okay. we got some data here. We got some data okay. here, right? Okay. What's we'll fuck right? right? Okay. Let me ask you a question. What's up? How many? Uh, 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 in your honest opinion, how many months of the year do you think Madden charts? How many months of the year? Mm -hmm. Most of the year. year. Most of the year. Isn't that? Can you get that goddamn game when you ask day and date? On EA Access day and date? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think so. Okay. So, again, it doesn't affect the system. Those that want EA Access or can have access to the game or EA Origins, still yeah. want to buy the game. That's not going to stop Matt and Cell. EA is a, let me tell you something. Fuck Sony, fuck Microsoft. You know, EA is going to get a dollar. Mm -hmm. Am I right or am I wrong? Yeah. They're going to get a goddamn dollar. If you think, if you thought by them putting their goddamn games in their day and date, right? Yeah. Would it affect the bottom line of them still on? You think they would do it? No. True, true they, that. They make more money the other way. I'm getting, listen, I'm cheating right now. I got, I got some industry for. I'm cheating right now. So I'm literally, I'm cheating. So I'm like, no, I'm not, at least I'm being honest. I'm cheating. I just got to some notes. But okay. I'm telling you that they will make more money the long in the long, much more money, much. Think about this. All games. You, you, look, I'll give you an example. Uh, 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 what just came out? Right. Um, Assassin's Creed Odyssey came out when? In October. October. The one, uh, I, yeah, I think October. The game was already thirty bucks. Thirty Cause, bucks because it's dog shit. 
I'm lying. 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 I'm
is pretty much, you know, like Spotify or Netflix. Move away from physical and direct digital sales to subscription service. That way they got you locked into the ecosystem. Period. Do you think uh, that's that's the ultimate goal? Goal? do you think the ultimate goal is a world where gaming is primarily done through PS Now and Game Pass? Wouldn't shock you, you but that's the do you think that's their 10, 15 year, 20 year vision? Uh, you know what? I honestly, bro, sad to say, and it's because whether you know, we gotta be honest here. I, I, would, I, I like they'll stop well, like like because this is I, the, I, the reason I, why I, I said yeah, because one of the re the reason why I say this, one of the things that makes Netflix successful is a lot of their content you cannot get anywhere else. Like you can't get Daredevil on disc. Like you can't buy their shows. Like the only way to get their shows, a lot of their big shows, you have to be a subscriber of Netflix. You can't buy. I mean, yeah, obviously you could pirate the shit, you know. But talking about legally, right? Like your Blu-ray player disc. Is useless when it comes to a lot of the Netflix shows because they don't sell it. Like they don't make box versions. They don't offer it for you to digitally buy it. Like you gotta subscribe to Netflix if you want to watch these shows. Do you think Sony and Microsoft will little by little pull them stunts? Like, hey, we got a special offer. Here's yeah, a Game Pass PS Now exclusive. May not be got a war Halo. Obviously, they're not gonna go hard, but it might be a new single A, you mm -hmm. know, IP. It might be a Private Rush Three. It might be. You know, um, Orient of Life. I, I think, it might I, I be Cuphead too. But I think the end game, or overall, honestly, um, and and not that I like it. That what I like this. What costs the most for these companies to do what? Is to the R and D yeah. to make in consoles. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, maybe not this. I know not this. Maybe not. Maybe not the next two generations. But maybe after that, maybe we all will just have a control. You, you log into your PlayStation account. On your and, TV and play, yeah, you know, whatever, and play. Have access to not saying again that I like it, but yeah, I'm just I, bro, I'm telling you, it scared the hell out of me. You know what I mean? Pulling up that Google stream because I was, you know, I wasn't expecting that a console like experience, you know, on the even machine. You know what I mean? Just put my controller up and, and do and, and take off and play. You know what I mean? Um, I'm with you. I'm like old school, you know, like to sit down, plug my I like unboxing the console, take the styrofoam out, the wrapper, the sticker, that whole, you know what I mean? But yeah. and again, uh and I, and I say this again because just looking at my grandson and my daughter, how they consume what they're playing. You know what I mean? They got many more years to play than I have left on this earth, right? I think they're gonna remain gamers, right? So they don't care how they get whether it's Roblox or yeah. For me, a fortnight or whatever the case may be, they outnumber us, you know, 10 to 1. You know what I mean? We're dying. Yeah. They're just coming up and gaming. And again, so that's just the old way of us a static boxing is playing it. You know, and I'm not saying again, I, I, I like the concept again. Who, you know, he said gaming is a very, very selfish hobby. Fuck my need. And listen, it was, it, was, it was really caring about their core and how they feel. You know, my, you know, my P Xbox schools won't be on PC day and day. You know what I mean? They fuck the. We last of a non breed. We the motherfucker. You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's a rat. You know what I mean? So I think you know three generations. You know, I blame y'all motherfuckers. Y'all don't buy y'all games. Y'all you, know I mean? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, part of it, I did my part. Man. Where your soul at? You know? You know <laughs> what's the finds you? Who the finds you? <laughs> All hey, these you know, <laughs> with the silly faces. Silly hey, what the fuck, what the fuck was I talking about when I was talking about that shit? <laughs> that was that was during our bag, man. You were bringing that up. Oh, yeah, <laughs> that yeah. was our bag, man. We were now bag. That was yeah. that was that that was a year yeah. long. What yeah. defines you? <laughs> Where yeah, your the soul at? Soul at? <laughs> with these silly faces. Do you want to walk with them or do you want to walk, walk with, with God? God? Make up Make your goddamn God mind. mind. <laughs> <laughs> so, you walk with them. Yo, you walk with God. God. Make up your goddamn mind. Yo, Stuart Stokes, he says, off topic, but how is my brother in law only played nine hours of Black Ops for all year and he is in the top 15%? Is 80% of Xbox users not turning on their Xbox? Yo, I was shocked about that because I'm like, yo, let me look at my stats because the only thing I really did was play Fight Night and Madden for a little bit. So I had 77 hours all year long on Xbox, and I was 14% of the top players playing it. And I'm like, what the fuck is... You know, Z and Z, we've been through this. We talked about this privately. Like, you even try to get people to game, they just don't come game. Like, you be mocking people, yo, 
trip, you know, triple B, bro, bamboo, let's do this. Gears. No one's answering up. And you're like, man, motherfuckers talk a lot about games, but no one's showing up. You know why? I'm going to tell you why, Porter Rock. Motherfuckers is getting old, man. <laughs> I, ain't, I ain't have the game moves up once as I used to be, bro. Are you doing two hour hour and a half podcast meeting when that game, but I'm in all that shit. Yeah, you know what I mean? <laughs> you know, shit. You know, you know that shit be. You will, yo, you will, that's why I bought Madden. I'm like, fuck it. You know, all everybody was like, yo, Madden's coming out here, actors. We're gonna do tournaments. <laughs> Motherfuckers like, we're gonna do a league. I'm like, fuck it. All yeah. right, cool. Hey, I'm a buyer, hey, man. I play hey, Marin, bro. That's who I play. Yeah, I'm like, I, I, motherfucker. I, I, I ain't trying to put that back. I'm dog shit, that man. You know, <laughs> that, motherfuckers that, still talking that, about leagues. Now you talking about some fight night. We can have fun going back and forth with that and yeah. shit like that. Yeah, motherfuckers, man, motherfuckers, man. motherfuckers, like, yo, Porter, you go buy Soul Calibur. I'm like, nah, y'all sucking me once. You know, I'm like, I'm, I'm like, I'm, I'm like, no, I'm like George Bush. I'm like, I'm like George Bush. I'm like, fool me once, shame on you. Fool me, man. A fool can't fool me again. <laughs> you just can't get fooled again. Yeah, Lionel. He says also the reason why streaming benefited music and movies on DVD the most was because it was too easy to pirate those things. That, and I will say this: music is probably the easiest thing to stream. Like you could stream it on a fucking twenty-five dollar phone on McDonald's Wi-Fi because it's a music file. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But you're talking about like I don't know how long it's gonna take for us to stream big budget triple A games. Like let's say Red Dead on a phone on Wi-Fi. It's gonna it's gonna be uh, I don't know. You know, most of these motherfuckers, well, you've seen the internet. Harry Hack, he says Game Pass equals ten dollars a month. Microsoft takes five dollars a month in pure profit. Third party publishers take three and two dollar goes to a game pass first party fund. From there, all them pick cents. Oh shit. He says the service is dog shit. He says, oh, shit. But anyway, let's move on to the next thing. You know, so PS Now, man. Where's that? I mean, the future is different, bro. That's one thing we call agree on. We don't know what the fuck these companies are doing. I mean, like, and we don't, and to be honest, like, this shit might fail. Like, you know, shit fails all the time. You know, everybody was all in on fucking, you know, look at, look at Microsoft and Sony. Everybody, they were all in last gen trying to do motion controls, you know, with Kinect. Sony with the move controllers, Nintendo with the Wemo, because Nintendo was on their bag, right? And all that shit died. All that we motion bullshit, shit that shit died. Yeah, so we don't know. This shit might be like, yeah, yeah, this is the future. And these motherfuckers, you know, the phone gamers might be like, fuck you. I play Clash of Clan. I don't play Call of Duty. Get the fuck out of here with your bullshit. And then Microsoft and Sony might be like, oh, shit. What the fuck do we do now? These motherfuckers ain't buying our games. They're not subscribing to our service. Like, oh, shit. Kind, you know, it might, you, know, you never, I will say this. Console gamers, we stood the test of time. In the world, when in a world where motherfuckers were telling us all oh, console gamers are dying, it's going to be about the phone. Shit, we just got three consoles that sold over a million in one month. A piece, you know what I'm saying? Consoles ain't dying. Like we stood the test of time, generation after generation. It's everybody else that's finicky. Phone gamers and we motion motherfuckers and Jane Fonda, you know the Dr. Trey weirdos. You know we stood the test of time on what we want. We want a dedicated unit with compelling games. With a fucking controller. That shit stood the test of time going back to the Coleco vision. It's everything else that's here today, gone tomorrow. U Force, Power Glove, Bazookas, 3D glasses, fucking 3D TVs, fucking Connect, Wiimote, Move Control, now all that shit here today, gone tomorrow type shit. But at the end of the day, what stood true and, to, and stood strong was a dedicated console. You connect to your TV and you played the fucking games with a controller. PS Now, I, I see I see PS Now streaming all that shit. They're trying, but that may not be successful. That shit could be a failure because phone gamers, what they want is their candy crush. They may not want Halo. They might be like, the reason why we don't play Halo is because we don't want Halo. We want candy crush. Get the fuck out. That shit might yeah. fail. That's not a guaranteed success. Just because well, it's I, being I, offered. It, it, it was working right now for Nintendo with their console shit on the go. Yeah. Wow. They're not streaming their actual you know, about, like, like the game, you know. I'm just, you know, just well streaming. Oh yeah, but but what they're doing, Nintendo's making see Nintendo's actually making mobile games for mobile. Like even Sony. No, no, I think no, I think no, their no. second billion no, no, franchise it, is a mobile no, game. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying wow. is that you say like you play games on the go, you know, yeah. like you know what I mean? Again, it, oh, it's too much game. It works. Oh like, yeah, but it, that's it, native though. They it, but if it really works, I mean, one thing is uh, with the new technology and again, what I experienced when I played, yeah, it felt like I, I couldn't tell the difference if it was streaming. Or if it was native, it was just that good. You know, I'm not talking. You know, I mean, if you can have pick up, you know, it's you know, again, if it works out in the world, wow, you can pick up and have what you have right now, 
and take it with you want to go and play. And there's no difference between, you know, you putting a diss in and, and, and you actually playing or whatever. Yeah. And I guess one of the, one of the thing, main things that people brag about the Switch that I could take with me anywhere I go, whoop whoop, you know what I mean? If you better take Red Dead with you on the go and that motherfucker actually work, yeah. it may be appealing to a lot of people. I'm not, you know, it's not that serious to me. I ain't trying to game, you know, I got my head on the swivel mountain streets. I ain't, <laughs> you know, I ain't, you know, they's not, I'm not knocking it, but that's not my thing. But you know what I'm saying? But again, there are a lot more outside of us, P Rock. You know what I mean? They don't care about none of that, you know? You know, so again, like I said, it's all if it works and we back the stream. Again, it's scary. It's new. You know what I mean? I, I, I like my static box. Plugging my console up and playing and boxing my shit. So, ain't nothing like getting well, I was saying, you know, console. you made an interesting point because, well, this is more Japan. Um, Switch is streaming Resident Evil 7 mm -hmm. because Capcom said there's no way for them to actually develop the game on the Switch. It's not powerful yeah. enough. So their answer was, we're just going to stream it, right? Mm -hmm. And you could play Resident Evil 7. The, the game failed in Japan. No one's doing it. Mm -hmm. This is Japan. Japan has the best wireless network. And no one's doing that over there because the game's not running native on Switch. The Japanese ain't playing Resident Evil 7 on Switch. It failed. Like, Capcom is streaming the game because they can't put it on the Switch because it's not, you know, the way they design doesn't have enough memory. So the Capcom's answer was, let's stream Resident Evil 7 to the Switch. And they have it. It's up and running. But no one's actually doing it. Right. You see what I'm saying? They, and this is Japan. This is mobile. That, that's what they mostly play. They're not console centric no more. They are on the go. That, that's what they do now. And they didn't rock with Resident Evil 7 streaming over there. And they have the 5G, all that bullshit. They have it. They're ready. They're playing. You know what I'm saying? That's why I don't know. It's it's we're just gonna have to see. I this this let's pretend let's put it this way. We all can agree that the companies are going to push forward with this. That's that's guaranteed. That's not even, I don't mm -hmm. think that's even an argument anymore. Sony's doing it. Microsoft's doing it. Google's doing it. Amazon's doing it, right? That, that's a guarantee. So they will push the streaming agenda. That's happening. That's not, that's not in question anymore, right? They're going to do it. They're going to put their money in. They're going to bank on that. The one thing that's not guaranteed, though, is the acceptance of the service. That's not guaranteed. We don't know if people really want this and be like, nah, this is, I'm not going to waste my fucking phone bill over this shit or my fucking bandwidth over this shit on my phone, whatever. That may not or may not happen. The companies are going to be all in, but this may not be a success. It may not be a success as we think, you know, this might be a niche product in the end of the day for people with good Wi-Fi in their homes. This might be just a niche market of that yeah sure they make their money but this might just be a niche market of people at home with good wi-fi but everybody else pretty much ignores it it's just really the you know it's just a minority that that everybody's all in but this may not be a success that's all i'm saying it's still up in the air whether this is something that's gonna be the mainstream that's all i'm saying at this point we have to it's still a wait and see on if this is adopted i'm gonna tell you this i'm not gonna jump in the pool and replace console gaming with streaming I don't give a fuck. That ain't happening. Especially me in North Carolina with Time Warner Internet. Fuck you. <laughs> fuck you, bro. I won't be gaming. Like, half the time, I won't be gaming on that shitty-ass dog shit. We ain't got fucking Verizon Files up in that motherfucker. I got a fucking hamster on that shit. Yo, so let me talk about this. Let's. Uh, what's the next topic? Crackdown 3. All right, so this is the part where I need Z to confess his sins, man. Rumor Stop. out here hyping... Crackdown one enhancement, and people are like, "Yo, Z, bro, that that's Crackdown three. Uh, Tell me, talk to me, brother. What happened? Why was the confusion? Like, what amen. did you see, man? Hey, man, I hey, said, man, uh, 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 different shit. Different shit. Different shit. Different shit. No, you know what's crazy, It did look man. better. Yeah, you know what's crazy? Than San Diego like, Comic Con. I'll, you know, I'll, I mean, I'll give I, you that. Listen, I'm not. In the, I'm not his thing, right? I remember right when I said that uh when you know when they showed that they showed that Comic Con right yeah and then you know no Z you know they they, you know, they cursed me out again when that's just the art style of crackdown and, <laughs> and I said it looked like what the fuck does this look like shit right yeah. they told me to wait to the, like the Tokyo Game Show and all that shit right so it looked horrible right and I said graphically you know what I mean and, and again it's all we just talk about what we just what we see it looked horrible mm -hmm. we just came for what we see right. 
And um, they told me about the art style, the direction, this, that, and the other, mode cap gaming and all that dumb shit, right? So then Microsoft came out about two weeks later and said they was holding it back for the visual fidelity. Kudos mm-hmm. to them, right? Now, which is the graphic, the fidelity, the graphics, right? Yeah. So now they show this new thing. And it looks, I, I, I just did a video. I did a side by, you know, more or less. Let's see how I look down, how I look. I'm not saying it's going to be fun. I never care for Crackdown. Yeah. Never been my thing. But it looks like shit. It's cheesy as hell. Like I said, they had you know when they had him fighting the Bushmaster. Like, shit, <laughs> trash. Bro. Shit, trash. I'm gonna try it for ten dollars, obviously. But like, this is this is 2019, and you got the world's most powerful console. Yep. And this is how you kicking off 2019. Now compare that to the graphics of, of Days Gone, with like ten thousand fucking zombies running at you. Ugh. This shit yep. is wild, bro. Like, what the fuck is Microsoft thinking, bro? This shit is wild, man. Uh, yeah. I told you, though. It's that Xbox template. Yo, man. the world's most powerful console, bro. And yeah. Crackdown's your headliner to kick off 2019, bro. That shit well, is well, wild. Yo, you're going to be mad when you play that. I could see your comparison. You're going to put that, what's that guy's name? Whatever, St. Mark from Days Gone, and you're going to yeah. put a side-by-side picture with Terry Crews. Yep, and you're gonna be like, mm-hmm. I got the world's most powerful console. <laughs> you, know, but, you know what's crazy though? <laughs> you, know, you know, this we gonna be cracking and slacking all over again. Hey, you never look at this thing overall, right? You said, Z, what about those man? Fuck that water. Fuck, about the <laughs> Fuck that water. <laughs> yo, that's <laughs> <one. laughs> you know, like, overall, right? And yo, Z was like, yo, no, that one thing you were like, I guess you were talking about um, uh, that Windows Central dude. Oh, oh, be yes. like, yeah, yeah. It'd be like, you know, they're like, you know, I'm being bad. I'm infringing on people's rights. Oh, I'm dying. I'm like, yo. Yeah. I was like, yo. Yeah. And they took my black ass out the community, didn't they? Oh, Jesus shit. Christ. Um, oh, check this out, though, right? What's up? It's overall, when I say there's a problem, and it looks like they make a to correct their problem. The best game we've had on that platform outside of Gears of Force and Halo. Last two and a half, three years is a twenty dollars title in Cuphead. Yeah, um, that, that game is good. Yeah, and, and oh, it's great, great game. You know what I mean? Oh, you, oh, like, before that, you may yeah. see Ori. And, or you know, yeah. for those, I think Ori and just going to be two is going to be awesome. You know, um, you know what's funny? Ori and Crackdown. I mean, Ori and and Cuphead yeah. are actually the two best new IPs. Yeah, for right the on, yeah. platform that's yeah. going to be pushed forward to Xbox Scarlet. That shit is bananas. Yeah, but 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 but, but here's the thing, right? Two Indies. Uh, now th- that's their franchise. Th- Two Indies. Uh, exactly, exactly. And, and and that's kind of my point, right? Those games would do awesome on the Switch, right? It fits that platform perfect. You got the world's most powerful six T flop system. Those are not the showcase games you should be showing on that system, <laughs> and, and and unfortunately. They are. They're the highest rated games that they have are those games. And so Yo, shout out to my sponsor, Blue Mustang. He says, I got a free year of Game Pass, so Crackdown is no loss to me. <laughs> you got that shit from me and shit. I know, right? <laughs> yo, yo, so crack yo, so all right, next topic. I mean, crackdown, we're gonna try it, man. I mean, we're gonna we're gonna rock out. I, I gotta find a reason to turn this motherfucker on. We're gonna auto aim. On PC, so we're gonna we're gonna auto aim shoot. You know we're gonna rock out with that, right? But now, Halo, getting oh, yeah. that first class treatment on PC. Z, preach to me, brother. What message is Microsoft? What did Microsoft tell you when you read that statement? Halo yeah. and that first class treatment. If PC's getting the first class treatment, then what are you getting? With the world's hey, most powerful console. Hey, bro. Hey, listen, man. What hey, the- what, he what said, "Win ten fan, win ten fan." Tell you, you got to sit in the back of the bus. Oh, is that what's it's happening always, again? Yes, always, man. You know what's crazy, though, right? And, I, and it's real shit, right? That's when I, I tell my folks, you got to step outside of the outside of your character, and and, 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 and it's all entertainment, right? But as I'm a consumer and a gamer first, right? And if you want things to get better, or to you know, you got to be honest. Mm. And some of these motherfuckers, oh, Phil Spencer, Pedo, hit this. Let me pull, let me taste this. Like, this shit is crazy. This is a cult. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like, this shit is a cult. Yeah. You know what I mean? And, and again, you know, I, I told them I'm going to tear this motherfucker down and build a new after my image and after my likeness yeah. because 
I mean, day and <laughs> day, man. It's the same thing with Gears of War 5. You know what I mean? Yeah. Aim for 4K 60. Oh, or yeah. They, they they actually yeah, showed you know what I mean? so, not even the Xbox One X version. They showed the no. PC version. Yeah, you know what I mean? They ain't nothing new, bro. Like, you know what I mean? I, I'm used to it by now. So that's it, man. <laughs> yeah. Fuck that water. You know, that's one minute. Right <laughs> And so, so you, do you think it's going to change next generation when they get the new four, four new consoles? Oh, this yeah, is uh, you know what? I'm gonna be honest with you. I, I think real talk. I think in, if if they come out and be the behemoth that they were, and see the see kind of and it kind of kicks off and takes kicks ass, then now you know maybe they become the priority again. But if it don't, no, it's things are gonna stay the same. Mm. You know, if 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 if, if the Anaconda can find the success. Of the with the 360 hat, you know, mainstream, you know, what I mean, of course, you're going to placate to that audience, you know, what I mean, or whatever. But yeah. you know, if it doesn't, you know, no, you know, it's the same shit going, or maybe even worse. We would PC make this year first. We may have to wait six months. Oh, no, don't do that. Don't do that. You get messed now. You get messed now. You get messed now. You get or change.org begging for you know for petitions for you know to get oh for game. Halo game and shit. Yeah, but you know what's crazy awesome. though? I mean, granted, they did it with Gears Tactics though. That shit's yeah. on PC at yeah. a minimum. PC first. PC first. Yeah, I don't, I don't yeah. Think crazy, bro. Which is banana. You know, Z called it with Age of Empires. He's like, this is an Xbox show, mm -hmm. and the only game announcement was on PC. He says, this is this is bad. This is gonna get worse. Yeah. And then what did they do at E3? They announced Gears Tactics for yeah. PC. He's like, <laughs> yo, it's crazy, right? It, it, and now it, Minecraft, yeah, now right. Minecraft and all, all that shit, bro. That shit ain't gonna stop. Hey, he used to get you give him an inch and take a mile, man. Oh. I said, say at some point you gotta put your motherfucking foot. Now, I thought Kid Smooth had woke up, but he done fell back into a dynamic coma. They, oh, what's going on here? Hey, bro, I've been, <laughs> hey, bro, I done been to woke up. You know what I mean? He said, hey, what my shoot? Pardon me, what's going on? Yo, hit the like button. Yo, all right. So holiday theme, right? Um, so <laughs> Sony has this holiday theme, right? And uh the the S on PlayStation is replaced with a five, right? Mm -hmm. So is Sony right now doing their, their fuck shit, teasing shit. You think you think Sony's ready to fucking unveil PlayStation Five in twenty nineteen? You think they're ready? You think yes. they have that couple ready? Yes. And that's what we're gonna see in November. Yes, like it's happening. Like yes. right now, they're, they're, they're not fucking around. They're like, we launching the PlayStation Five now. Hey, it's look, happening. We're not waiting for Xbox. We don't care what the Anaconda's doing. We pushing PlayStation Five now. The, look, this this is Sony wants that they. You know, they got killed last generation when they launched a year later. Oh. They don't want to give up anything. They want to continue this hype train that is the PS4 and that is PlayStation. They want to, and, and everybody's mindset on their IPs. They control the narrative. They want to keep that going to next generation because it's worked for them, right? They were able to um, basically keep the narrative after the world's most powerful console came out. They were still able to win MPD and, and win the hearts and the minds of the gamers. And that is what's going to keep propelling them going forward. So who cares if the next generation system, if they don't have the most powerful one, because by that time they would have already had 20, 20 million consoles and they are the, def they would have the de facto lead and, and obviously their IPs will be continuing moving forward. So I think, yes, I think these PS fives are sitting somewhere in that, in a warehouse uh ready i just think they're just ready for the right time sean Layden keeps saying uh i'll see you in 2019 and then they release these themes on the uh play you know for free on the playstation store for us with the uh playstation with the five logo instead of the s they know what they're doing and i you know you can say what you want but man i think this thing is is near and, and close and i, I think i think we're gonna see it uh, i think we're gonna see it come a lot earlier than most people would think now if they're gonna announce now if they're gonna announce a playstation 5 why not at e3 why did why would they choose There's not to play I'm, I'm gonna Packs tell you why no 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 no, no, no. It, it won't happen at pax out because i'm going to pax out and that's in january what the it fuck is the pax? yeah it's it's it, it's it's their gaming show it's not as big I know as that, but i mean i know what pax is i'm yeah. being facetious but yeah. compared to e3 what are the I mean, the only thing I could think of is a dedicated PlayStation show, but even That's then, true. E3 is huge. Like I, I, get it. I, I get it, right? I get it. 
But you got to think about it this way, right? PSX was so successful in what 2017? Was 16. it? No, that was, that was 16. That was, that was, 16. 16. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. 2016. Yeah, nobody give a fuck about that dog shit. Well, so. yeah, I, 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 I get it, right? I get it. Trump's I, I like it. me. We but, don't give a fuck about that shit. I, I get it. But here's the thing. Yeah. They have the IPs you want. They have already sold you on the PS5, whether you know it or not. They yeah, already sold you. That, you're you're looking forward to the fucking to the sequels to the games they already blew you away with, let alone the ones that they the new ones they have come. So they, sure. yeah. Yeah. they yeah. They've already yeah. sold you. So if you sit out there lying to yourself, you're lying to yourself. They already sold you. You you want yeah. to play Spider Man. I already too. know. I so I know they already sold me, but yeah. I'm the hardcore. But, I but, but here's the thing, right? They still want to expand that base. They do care about hardware. They do care about, and they have the software to push hardware. They got a whole VR platform that they're going to push you on. They got the whole streaming shit that they're working on. They have a lot of stuff going. And they could, I hate to say it, but it is true. PlayStation is the industry now. They demand such a lead, and there is really no competition. And this is why we were talking about earlier, without competition, it's really kind of bad, right? Because guess what? Now Sony is not forced to do anything that they don't want to do. Now they don't have to fucking show up at E3. And guess what? People probably won't care because all they got to do is show you a trailer of The Last of Us 2 and, and have you fucking talking and, and you'll forget all about what Microsoft is showing at E3. And that's yeah. why, right? The companies get cocky um, because they, it, you know, if they have something to back it up and they know, yeah, you'll be mad now, but guess what? I'll just show you a little something later and you, you'll shut up and you'll be happy. That is, yeah. what, that's what they're doing. And they're going to yeah. come up with an event um, probably in the first three months of 2019 or they'll let you know that, hey, we're going to have an event here. We're going to show you this. We're going to show you that. We're going to launch a console probably at the end of the year. Um, and and that, that's just my take on it. And that's what I think. I honestly think that that system is still going to rock mm -hmm. in 2019. Shout out to Raven I, He said, wasn't there an Xbox who got fined like 10 grand? Yeah, <laughs> yeah it, was, it was 13. It was, it was 20. It was, 20. It was, uh, so 20. you know that, you know that um, Xbox Mill Grawl? Yeah. Them Henrique motherfuckers, whatever yeah. from Brazil. Yeah. So I guess something happened. They got sued, um, you know, because they run a website, whatever. So they got sued in Brazil by journalists because um they were lying about the journalists saying that they were spreading false info and all that stuff. You know, the whole media bias, right? Yeah. But I guess in Brazil, that journalists can sue people making false claims like that. I guess it's kind of like defamation of character or whatever. Yeah, the U.S. is the only country where you can say whatever you want. You can yeah, so they lost the tape. Yeah. And, like, the judge saw the tapes of them talking shit, and the judge is like, like, he, he found it appalling that, like, grown men would just argue over company CEO. <laughs> <laughs> the judge, bro, they got fined $20,000. Fine $20, yeah. Well, wait a minute, the judge got... No. Xbox is the only fat boy community to actually get sued over this shit. Exactly. Like, oh, well, so they, wow, you got a bunch of people that like they biscuits buttery. Of course, they're gonna you know, owe some money. I remember somebody. you had Enrique on one of your podcasts. <laughs> Hello? Is he hurt? Yeah. Enrique. Who uh, kissed on the floor with the Xbox symbol? He went. The motherfucker got sued. <laughs> 20 yeah. G's in Brazil. Yeah, 20 <laughs> stacks. Yo, 20 stacks, God. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I'm yeah. fighting a good fight. The media bias. Yeah. The motherfucker. Well, God. let me say this about Halo. Let me Yo. say this about Halo. I love this. I'm a Halo fan as a new person getting into the oh, PC yeah. market. Yeah. I'm excited. I'm, I'm a big sci-fi guy. And the fact that I get, what you call it? Carte blanche or the red carpet or, you know, I'm getting the ultimate treatment. And the rest of these clowns are getting the gas face. Let me ask you this, though. You know, mm. Do you think Sony will eventually support PC? They don't they don't they do? No, PS correct. I'm not, talking about, I'm not talking about PS now. I'm talking direct download. Uh, oh, um, I, maybe like, one day. Like a, like a PlayStation store. Um, on PC. Maybe one day. I mean, I know people are clamoring for you know. You always get those petitions. Oh, yeah. You got the, you get, you, you get the hardcore PC gamers. You think they will yeah. dive into that? Uh, yeah, they would. Oh, Sony? Possibly. Yeah, I mean, right now, they can do whatever the hell they want. They're, they're like the 85 Bears. I'm showing my age. <coughs> the 85 Bears, okay? That's the monsters I mean, of the midway. You know, yeah. just it is what it is. Yeah, you put rock. Rock. I put rock. Rock. They won a Super Bowl and shit. Put rock. You know what I want to know? Sure. I want to know how many <laughs> PC gamers are actually using PS Now. 
None of them. Very exactly. rare. I, 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 I would assume that, right? But I, yeah, but I, but I, but I can't blame them because then, then they're not gonna buy a rig to play a 720p fucking yes. piece of shit over I internet. Will. That's no, like, no, but, but here's about it. All, all of this streaming. They stuff want, they want their shit downloaded for 1080p. We spent the whole generation, half of the generation, arguing over 4K, right? And now, <laughs> it's now like motherfuckers, the whole industry wants to go to streaming fucking 1080p again. Like, <laughs> I, like yeah. what are we doing? I, that's why I don't think this is where the industry is going. I think that this is just something that they're trying to see what sticks to gain more revenue. I don't think there's much there, but it is what it is. You know, you obviously. All right, well, you don't you don't think Google's gonna be successful because that <laughs> was pretty impressive. Let, let me ask got. you this. Let me ask you this, Craig. Okay. Uh huh. You have an Xbox. You have a PlayStation. Uh, you have you have Assassin's Creed. By whatever. God. All right. 1080p. What? No, yeah, but let me ask you. This. What did that do for you more than your other consoles that you already had? Well, you might you might as well would would have played your S, your Xbox yeah. One S or your X. There is yep. no incentive for you to fucking go and, and, and mind you, these games are not going to be no fucking five dollar games for the full blown thing. These people are charging you fifty nine ninety nine for a game. Who wants to pay fifty nine ninety nine to stream this shit when you <laughs> buy it on your Xbox or your PlayStation? You, well, don't, have that's a good buy, you don't have to go and buy a PS Five or a Scarlet to, to to play these games. All you got to do is just stick with what you're. Is, is, is Google yeah. Stream like a it's monthly Google service Google. or is it? Stream to you, but you I, still I, have to buy the game. No, you, you, you still, you still, you still, you still have to spend the money. You still have to buy yeah. the game. And, and Google, well, that uh, is it a subscriber, a subscribe service. Well, no, well it, they're, they're going to make they're, they're going to make a store for it. But the game, you still have to yeah. buy the games. That's you what I'm saying. Like, 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 you can't pay ten dollars a month and no, get access to no. games. Like, oh no, 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 no buying no, the no, games no, for sixty bucks. You have to buy the game. It's just like Nvidia, the Nvidia water. The shield, video shadow play and stuff like that. I have yeah. with the um with the whole shield console and, and the shield tablet. The, these games are full price games, $59.99. Right. So that's a big deal, right? It's 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 different. You know, I see Microsoft may have a little bit better luck with that because ten dollars you can play everything that you want in their library, yeah. right? Yeah. This is if you want to play, you know, Assassin's Creed yeah, or or any of these games, you have to spend fifty nine ninety nine, and I just don't see people ready to spend fifty nine ninety nine for yet another ecosystem. You yeah. see what I'm saying? I see what you're saying. But you're, 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 uh, at least with Xbox, right? You got all your shit from last generation. You got all your shit from this generation. You're good. But with Google starting, it's just going to be multiplats, and then like the multiplats, you might as well buy it on the PlayStation or the Xbox. It's an upward hill battle. But those guys, I get it. They got money, right? But think about it. Microsoft has the most money right now, so that shit doesn't even matter. They don't have the reach. They're not <laughs> in the gaming industry. They don't, you know, money. Money talks, but there's but something Google money can't buy, right? right? Money, yes. money cannot dethrone somebody who's been dominating for thirty five years, such as a well, Nintendo. No, but, well, but what if Google is years, is such as set this market? What if, what if Google just sets its sights on the North American market? You don't think they can compete? No, this North America. No, nope, nope, not at all. Sony, <laughs> Sony, Sony controls the North American market. It used to be Microsoft. It's Sony yeah. runs it, right? Sony runs it. Uh, again, you're telling motherfuckers that hey, you don't have to buy a console. Just spend fifty nine ninety nine with us and plug your controller into your computer, or your tablet, and you can play the game. That's fine and dandy, but you got to realize that fifty. It, it's not like an iPad, right? I got games on my iPad, but those games mm -hmm. I spend three dollars. Most of them are free. I spend. At the max, the game is ten dollars for full fledged games. The max, I'm willing to do that. I am not willing to spend fifty nine ninety nine on my iPad for an app or a game or whatever. I'm just not, and that's gonna be ninety nine point nine percent of everybody else who wants three ecosystems. I get it. We have a PlayStation, we have an Xbox, and you know, give it, give or take, we have a Switch. You're gonna add another ecosystem for me to go? No. And then most people have PCs too, so you got Steam. I mean, it's just there is nothing that Google can offer you that the rest hadn't already mastered. But it's Google. There you go. We got Stuart Stokes. He says, <laughs> "Man, Stuart, you're killing me here." He said, "I bet Post will be excited to get Phil's anaconda." Oh shit! Oh shit! Lionel B says, "Why if Sony can make a bigger and better conference every year on their own time?" Would you come promise that for them just to go to E3 every year? I don't think nothing would be bigger than E3. Here's the thing, I, and I'm with you about Sony the Sony is E3. 
It was well, listen, Sony's not showing up, and guess what? A lot of people are not gonna go because it's like, why the fuck do I want to go? You know what, I'm not. You know. I'm not gonna see the big <clears throat> games and the, the stuff that I'm gonna see from Microsoft uh, is not even ready to be shown. That stuff is but for next year. Here's the thing, though. You got bigger than Sony. You got everybody there. Yeah, oh, yeah. that's for the industry. Like that's for the media. Like there's but, nothing bigger than but, but Z, people well, I like it or not. Whether, whether, people whether, do not show up to E3 to see fucking multiplex. They don't go. Uh, they don't go. <laughs> to you go. You go to see what Sony's gonna bring. You go to see what Microsoft. Now, listen here. I signed my goddamn contract. Now, no, no, come on now. You put the lady on. Yeah. This motherfucker sound like a snail. Oh my god, is good. Wait a minute. Hey, 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 no. Oh, dude. Somebody big fish and live for three days. We don't want to preach about it. See, didn't somebody say that they were gonna try to break your jaw if you went to E3? <laughs> oh shit! Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Z say when he go to E three, he's showing up deep. We all gonna be in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you better not ride with him because he's not taking the plane. Motherfucker said, "Let's take a car ride." Hey, <laughs> hey, 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 hey I was trying to film it, man, on some oh, national lampoon shit. Oh, <laughs> you know what, huh? like we stopping the border, Texas. Then they want to fucking deport us. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Man, end up, it'll be like what is it? it'll be like Harold Kumar go to White Castle, a five minute <laughs> ride, and they end up. A five minute ride ends up in a venture and shit. We 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 end up having a dead body, drunk, 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 yeah. dead hookers. Like yo, hey, like, yo. Z oh, Z and Portal. Listen, man. Like, hey, hey, what? Hey, yo, you know, yeah, you know, nephew, my son, right? Needs me. I might put that battery in needs me. Let's, let's, let's ride to E three. Fuck it, oh. Z. Let's go. Bring up the tapes. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm going to have one to train, man. I don't know. Oh, man. Get the man, we're going to put you on the plane. We'll just give you some Vic- Vicodin and knock you the oh, fuck out. Right now, yeah. like, be able to ride. Like Michael Jackson? <clears throat> fuck is that? That's what we're going to do to your ass. Like, <laughs> like get your ass right. on a goddamn plane. <laughs> hey, I mean, yo, I am definitely afraid of heights, man. I don't know what the fuck. I used to be this way, man. I got PTSD bad like a motherfucker, bro. I'm fucked up. <laughs> now, what's that movie? Final Destination. After that shit came out, the first one. Like, I'm done. Like, I'm <laughs> done out here in these streets, bro. Shit, oh, man. What y'all getting tonight? What y'all playing? You playing anything? You, you take? You uh, back this way. I'm on this dog, yo. I'm on this dog shit. Red Dead, bro. Uh, hey man, that, I'm, this shit, I'm. That shit is boring, man. I'm fucking. Just, that shit's killing me. Yeah, I'm wrapping gifts for the rest of the night. Shit. Oh, shit. Lucky man. Lucky man. See, oh, he's no, I'm going to three, bro. It's three in the morning here. Hey, hey I'm on man. Jay, does he's getting ready for that Jesus birthday bash, man. They club it on. Hey, man, you ain't, you ain't shit, man. Uh, he's Jay, Jay giving out Mercedes to everybody and shit. He's yeah, like, yeah, right. I'm, I'm wrapping my ninth Mercedes. Shit. He's like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> who, 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 who's working on the ASCAP since this is my last oh, podcast of the year? Mm-hmm. I'm playing my... Spider-Man DLC. Oh, okay. So yeah. Yo, this is my last podcast for for the year and shit. You know, before I go to New York, so I want to ask y'all your quick recap for each of y'all. What y'all liked about 2018? What you didn't like about 2018? And just what you hope 2019 brings to you? We'll start. We'll start with Z. We'll start with Z. We'll start with Z. He's the guest. He's he's on his supreme FN shit. We're talking about you talking about uh uh uh, uh gaming wise or yeah, yeah, gaming gaming yeah yeah don't don't come with that me too hashtag shit. my wife left me <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, oh, gaming um, yeah gaming 2018 why what was your what was your strength chicken in there highs and lows I you know, want this fuck shit right so she you still ain't giving right? my 20 bucks give me a PlayStation bonus right check this shit out right okay. <clears throat> of course, I mean, the, to the PlayStation Nation. I would yeah, say that's you know, the high point. Yeah, yeah. You know, the lows was being, you know, me being ousted from the, the community that I created <laughs> with my bare hands and all that diabetic gaming and the fact that the cracking was like, <laughs> good night, Jesus. Hand. You know what I mean? You know, I, I no longer believe in Jesus behind that shit there. Uh, and, and, and um, the highs were being embraced by the PlayStation Nation. You know what I mean? I thought that rocked them. You know what I mean? Accepted me with, uh, uh, you know, you know, my man of very low integrity. A lot of the time, they they accepted me all my lies, all my transgressions. They accepted me for me. You know what I mean? <clears throat> hey, hey, like the Blues Brothers, we knew you one day you were gonna see the light. Yeah, you know what I mean. So that, that's what's up, though, man. But overall, though, you know what I mean. It's been, um, I, I guess the high, uh, the highs, though, honestly, God of War in Detroit, and I might put Detroit above God of War. Yeah, you know, you know, you know, you know why I will put Detroit above God of War. Great story. I didn't expect that. Yeah, that caught me totally off guard. 
I listen, I'm not, I've never been to Telltale Games or, you know, even whatever. Fuck. Like, and it may sound kind of cheesy, but that I got really enthralled and attention in that storyline. Like, yeah. you know, Black Lives Matter, bitch. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah, you know, pretty much. yeah, it's kind of like similar yeah, shit. Yeah, so, you know, the, the, the climate, Trump mm-hmm. in office, all this shit going on, like, man, on many sides. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, good people on many sides. There's a lot of shit going on when I'm playing that, man. Well, then Martin Luther King quotes and shit. Yeah, but this shit was like I ain't gonna lie that that that, that came out of nowhere, man. You know what I mean? So yeah. you know, you, you know, so that that was definitely like I said again was the, the high for me. And then you know what I mean? The high was I got a war <clears throat> Detroit. Uh, I'm gonna get back into Spider Man, but I'm right now. I don't like I don't enjoy Spider Man as much as I'm, I heard the story picks up at the end. Yeah, but not said it's not a great game. Uh, but as much as I enjoyed uh, God of War and um, <clears throat> Detroit Become Human. Uh, and I'm enjoying Battlefield One. Like that's something again that I well, yeah, you never really liked that game. No. You didn't really like first person shooters. No, but I see no. I see you doing streams. Yeah, bro. I you know, actually I think I got a little battle quick scoping and all that type shit, bro. You know what I mean? So and post up in his bag with four kills. <laughs> <laughs> hey bro, we old bro. Sometimes <laughs> <laughs> like I'm in my bag since four. I was like, what? When you like, don't, we call us out, what damn dust us the fuck over. We talk, I'll be talking, nigga, how about nigga, boot up, man. They're going to dust our old ass. I think we're going like eight and three. I'm in my bag. You see that shit right there? Hey, yo, motherfucker, we're going like 30 and five. We're talking about six and two. like, I'm in my bag. He, he's like six and four. I'm like, oh, oh shit. Boy, hey, shit. And then, you know, when Pulse get to play, he falls asleep dead in the middle of the stream, starts snowing. I'm like, oh, <laughs> shit. Talk all that shit. We ain't got it no more, bro. Mm-hmm. But that's that, that definitely been a high for me, though. Honestly, though, like I said, God of War Detroit, and, and again, I said, you know, Battlefield 1, like, you know, like, uh, and of course, the lows, every, the lows, everything I got from the goddamn Xboxes. <laughs> <laughs> Free smoke. Oh, oh, hey, yo, J-Dubs, highs and lows, man. Oh, man, this was the, man, this was the best year of gaming in a long time. Uh, it just this was the highlight of this generation 2018 and i'm expecting 2019 to be even even bigger um this this year defined what playstation was and what microsoft was and what nintendo you know what what they are and so you know i had a, I had a great time man this 2018 that shit i can repeat this year all over again man it was it was great a shitload of games uh a lot of high quality exclusives a lot of the game game of the year contenders. I mean, everybody's pumping on all c- cylinders. Uh, Twenty nineteen, um, <coughs> man. I do honestly. I believe it's the it's the year of the PlayStation Five. It's the year of the PlayStation. We got uh, you know, hopefully the Last of Us, Days Gone, Ghost of Tsushima, um, uh, Death Stranding, and stuff like that coming out. That a lot of you know highly anticipated games. I'm looking forward to that stuff. Nintendo's going to keep you know. Uh, kicking ass, creeping up, and doing their thing, and you know, hopefully Microsoft can show us what their future is about. You know, I don't expect a lot of big stuff from them because you know they're kind of winding down for next gen. But we'll see. I think 2019 is going to surprise us. I think we're going to get a bunch, a bunch of huge surprises that we don't know about. And so that's 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 my take on it. All right, Craig. Uh, yeah, yeah, game of the year. Honestly, I've always said it's when Detroit become human. Um, that really. Uh, gripped me. That story had me going, you know, what do I do? I was going back and replaying things to look at that. You know how you had that it would, you would finish the episode and it had that tree up. It's like, oh, I missed all that. And I was trying to go back and try to do that. Uh, best two moments for me, uh, one of uh, uh, J-Dub and you and Z, uh, you know, getting that, uh, that console for post-up, the Spider-Man thing. I thought that was really cool with both of you guys. Yeah, man, yeah. that was no. Yeah, I thought that was really cool. And you see your story about uh, getting your jaw broke, or whatever. That really that <laughs> afternoon you were doing that podcast had me had me cracking up. So yeah, I certainly hope that, that uh that was, bag. Bag. that was in my bag, man. Yeah, that was funny. But uh so for 19, yeah, this uh, hopefully the uh the Xbox community will not have their biscuits so buttery next year. Just enjoy the games you got. <laughs> Hey, hey, like, you sound like a black Kenny Rogers brain when that exit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm down south. I'm proud of it. I'm down south. Yeah, with the whiskey clothes and the, 
and the horses run. Yeah, so, I'm right. the conservative all day. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> all right, man. Before going to my shit, Stuart Stokes, he says Sony's in the perfect position. MS is rushing to start next gen. So Sony can wait, see what they have, and plan accordingly. If they don't, PS4 still selling. Uh, Raven Flow. Oh, shit. I went right past it. Where's Raven Flow at? Raven Flow. I miss the... I miss the EA that made ripoffs. Raven of- Flow. You miss the EA ripoffs, <laughs> Sony. I, I was reading. I ain't want to be... Like, what the fuck? I miss the he EA that made ripoffs of Sony exclusives. Really? I guess. I missed the... E- I missed the... I don't know. It's lost in translation, man. I got a lot of drinkers on my podcast. Said, that was my bag, man. My bag, man. <laughs> no, I'm going to say this. The highs, obviously, the games. Obviously, you know, God of War. You know, to have God of War and Spider-Man in the same year, in the way they came out, that shit is huge, right? Uh-huh. Another high for me was fucking your, your fucking Z's Entertainment, bro. In the beginning, <laughs> Diabetic Gaming... Oh, and yeah. crack was lacking. Yo, yeah. that shit hey. was fucking real, brilliant, real talk. bro. Real talk. So when, yo, when I heard Z say the cracking is lacking, I'm like, yo, this yeah. motherfucker did it. He got another. He, he was like DJ Khaled. <laughs> <and> another <laughs> one. Talk about that one. Hey, 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 he did hashtag hey, diabetic hey, gaming. Hey. I'm like, oh, <laughs> hey, 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 yo, they shut my black ass up quick with that shit. Yo, they got my black ass. Like, oh, <laughs> oh, that that shit became <laughs> themes, bro. Diabetic gaming became a theme, bro. They got my black. I'm always good for my mom. Let's move above there. I came back. I went and got me a coffee. Came back. Once it goes. Yo, another high point when Z out there saying that you know developers need to make more games and everybody was against them. Yeah. And then when they started announcing more games, they all flipped the script. And Z's and like, you know what's crazy? Bro, what the that, fuck is going on here? I you, know, you know, I, t- I told you before that they, they do. They did, that's that's not new. That's just you know. And again. Maybe this me being naive. I, I at one time I held you know Xbox guys to a higher standard. This is the world, you know. I mean, you got we with Sony Point. I just you know I just I realized the fanboy is a fanboy, yeah. no matter the controller. It's real shit. Yeah. And you and you have to. And I know this too. Like motherfuckers, we do this for entertainment. Like you know, we cut up, we argue <laughs> after the show. That's it. You know what I mean? You know, we back to bucking the fuck out. You know what I mean? Yeah. And I get it. Like people get behind these consoles like this. They're they're. Uh, favorite console, I mean, like their favorite sports team, whether they admit it or not, it is what it is, right? Cool, right? All for the full ring fuckery, right? But anything they pick in their favorite preferred platform in the negative light, they don't want to talk about it, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. You know, or whatever. But I'm from the mindset if you want things to change or get better, you have to be honest. Because I've always said you'd be surprised who watches your fucking show. Like, I just I got some people, you know, some more information from an exec just now, you know, from the end to what the money, like I said, yeah, oh, so I don't even think about that. They make way more money, you know what I mean? That's why you know EA actually they bought that they bought that whole thing. Why do you think you have uh Madden back on PC and all that shit again? It's a fucking gold mine, you know what I mean? It's still and Madden's still gonna try every goddamn month, you know what I mean? But I don't hit and I always said this, right? I I it just fucking so fuck it the hell about here. Uh oh like, you know what what I do what we do is you know, people get caught up in the character of next gen or Porter Rock. I got motherfuckers mad, you know, fucking like, you fucking Porter, he's a Sony guy. I'm like, fuck, like, you know what I mean? No one's about to do nothing weird, say about my family, you no know, racist shit, bro. It's just fucking video games, right? Yeah. But they get again caught up in the character and don't want and I'm not taking the Tony shots. I let the hey say the hey say Trump base, they don't want to let their base down. Like yeah. they want whoever to make them feel to feel good about or validate their purchase. Yeah. You know what I mean? Or whatever the fuck. I ain't here to stroke nobody ego. You know what I mean? And I don't care who don't speak to me. Like, you know, if, if you don't, if you choose not to speak to me because I'm talking about what's right or just, you know what I mean? I'm like, crazy, man. Like, bro, I was joking about it. Motherfuckers really talking about knocking me the fuck out. I was <laughs> trying, but, you know, it's funny as hell talking about, you know, I can be sued because I'm infringing on people's rights. And it's like, yeah. I'm infringing on people's shit. rights. <laughs> I told you I ain't gonna lie on nobody. I tell true stories that's funny. I ain't gonna lie on nobody. Like, you know what I mean? I tell true shit that's funny. You know what I mean? It, it's funny when I come out and say it. That's how I'm, when I'm reading this shit, you're gonna sue me for what? What dog shit you know? <laughs> I'm gonna get a ham sandwich and a cup of coffee like this week. Oh, I'm gonna say, I'm right. No, no, you hit it. You hit on one of my lows, which was everybody's mm-hmm. taking this shit too serious. You know, after the shit I saw with J Dub, I'm like, man, these guys I, are not. You know what? Hey, but no, listen, I, 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 
I was the first person to come lose my life in the war. I came oh. back with Twitter. <laughs> yeah, that shit was cool. What I had about 8,000 followers? Yeah, that's <laughs> true. Yeah, yeah, that's true. What crap said? Yeah, some like shit, what, said, what crap said? Some shit about, um, yeah, uh, yeah, I'm not feeling well. I see you check your sugar, you fat bitch. Hashtag not better gaming. I came back. <laughs> bro, I, I, I literally, I went in. Bro, listen, I have a double nose down at the bottom of my block, right? Literally. I, I don't mean I got a knuckle that was at the end of my block and walked there, right? My choosing yeah. lazy ass. Yeah. What then got a coffee? Walked the dog, I had a little bullshit ass dog. Had that motherfucker in my hand, picked him up a little poop school. Went and got me a coffee, got my white man on, walked back up the hill, went to my house, sat down, went to log into the talk to my mushroom was gone. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> and they kept banning me. I'm like, you gotta I gotta create almighty I'm next gen. gen. <laughs> Yo. That shit crazy. Yo, yeah. Yo, you had that account from the start. Mm-hmm. And that's wow. gone, bro. That well, shit was tied to a Yahoo account. Like I, you know, I, I you know, he, like, he didn't even remember the Yahoo account. He like, I didn't even code to the shit. Like I don't fucking use Yahoo still, but that shit, the brother, my shit, all I said was, motherfucker, check. He said, crap, shit, yeah, I made not do no show today. I'm not feeling well. I said, ah, ha, check your sugar, you fat bitch. Hashtag die by the gaming. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Came in the back. Oh, yeah. I went got a coffee. I came back. And you know what? <laughs> JD, I remember we still hold up. We were sidebar. I remember we was doing the multiplayer podcast, and that shit was going down with J Dubs, right? J Dubs said, "Man, they trying to get me. So I'm trying to get you." I mean, I was saying, <laughs> I said, "What happened?" I said, "I don't know, man. They had me unblocked. I came back. I said, oh, man, what's going on?'" <laughs> she was wild. Like, hey, bro. Hey, we listen. We said, "A lot of you people in the audience, I don't be privy to a lot of shit that happened behind the scenes." Man, sometimes this shit be like beyond me. I'm like, "Yo, what the fuck is going on here, man?" Yo, when I when that's I the thing, man. They they don't see what happens behind the scenes, they right? Don't. They don't see. You. They who plays out in, in the podcast or out in yeah, the public but like behind the scenes? Be crazy man, it'd be it'd be it'd be a thousand times wilder. Hey, but this shit hit me tumble down ready GP 13. Like, I ain't gonna lie, put around this shit with chewing motherfucking Dina took on a motherfucking whole new different yo, this motherfucker. Yo, did yo, <laughs> this is thing, bro. This yo, yo dude, I don't get this. Oh, I the light button. Add on a kick did it. The light button. What happened? What happened? <laughs> Yo, I showed the DMs, the convo, and he's still <laughs> creating a whole new scenario. Yo, listen. So bad, man. Yo, D, D, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you like, because we didn't really talk about this. Listen, after I won the bet, right, yeah. he did not talk to me for the month of November or December, right? Oh my God, my God, my he God. hit me, he hit me up in January. He's like, yo, you know, my kid came up from Florida or something, whatever. And I'm like, cool. You know, I'm a father. I get it. I'm like, cool. Whatever. The 20 Every holidays, right? The 20. Huh? What they got to do with the 20. Exactly. I know, but whatever, you know, I'm not going to go there. Maybe, you know, I, I should have known something at that point, but I didn't, you know, at that point, it's the holidays. I'm a father. With any man that tells me hanging out with the kid, I don't fuck with that. I'm like, all right, whatever, you know, it's really, it's not a big deal. It's only $20. Uh-huh. I hit him up in March because I heard nothing. I'm like, yo, I'm like, like, yo, yo, D. I'm like, I'm like, yo, D, what's up, right? He didn't hit me back till April, and when he hits me back, it wasn't a conversation like he's saying, like, oh, yeah, you know, me and Puerto Rock talk. No, he instantly dropped Assassin's Creed Unity code and put bet paid. And I'm like, yo, D, the bet was $20. He replies back, what, you want more codes? I got Game Pass codes. I got Xbox Live codes. I'm like, nah, we're going to have fun with this now. Now now we're going to get on my phone. That's when I contact. I didn't know anything about the dollar at this point. That's when I contacted you. I'm like, yo, Z, this is what's going down. It was Z that told me. He's like, yo, he's like, yo, border oh, rock. He's like, yo, he's like, yo rock. that's like the dollar on CD cash. He's on, on CD chair right now. I'm yeah. like, what? Oh, yo, we doing a podcast. We're going to get this motherfucker on multiplayer podcast. We're going to get this dude. Me and Z that's playing right. this shit. Hey, yo, we, I, I showed Z the tweet and the DM. I'm like, we're going to set this motherfucker up, right? So, boom. Multiplayer podcast come. We set D up. We got him. We show the DMs, right? We clown him. Everybody's ripping him apart, right? Guess what he does two weeks later? He gets back to me with more codes. <laughs> no, he just lit this motherfucker up for pulling this bullshit. Like, he got lit the fuck up. And he at that point, I'm like, yo, I'm never going to see these $20. Like, this shit didn't happen. I'm like, fuck it, whatever, D. Like, give me the code. Well, I'm like, that's over, whatever. I know, like, it shouldn't be this hard for $20. Especially if you got stocks in AMD. Yeah. 
Hey, bro, this shit. Like, yeah. bro. <laughs> like this, yo, that hey, was the bro, hardest man. twenty dollars I ever. Hey, well, listen, can we get y'all back? Yeah, right. Listen, can we can we get y'all at least back on speaking terms? What did he do? Cool. I, I told I him about I need a difference. I need a difference. Seventeen dollars, and I replaced his school. Listen, listen, listen. I got uh, it. He he goes to GameStop. He opens up the cases. You know, people leave, crazy, they, they leave the little cards in the cases, and he just hey, grabs. Bro, you know what's crazy? I don't make this shit no better because I'm putting up little clips and shit like. like <laughs> you know what? And listen, if you know me, right? You, like y'all niggas, y'all, you know I cut the fuck up. I got a great sense of humor. Yeah. I joke all fucking day. I crack the jokes on every fucking body. I think these sometimes gets a little mad and shit. Cause one day he hit me like Z. This is not good for my fan base. My fans yeah. don't like when you clown me like that. They're starting to bully me. This is not good for my fan base. They say that you're bullying me. It's not bullying you. <laughs> hey, you know me. I just crack jokes all fucking day. Like, this is me. Like, they get on me. I get on them. You know what I mean? Little shit going on behind the scenes. Like, I just cut the fuck up. I just don't think D can take it like that, man. I don't know. No. You know what I mean? Like, now, he's saying, now he's saying, I'll give you $20, but you got to give me my clothes back. Them just like, man, I ain't wasting my time over this <laughs> shit. Yeah, look, I'm sure, I never get mad. Though. I only got mad at D. Let me tell you something. I got mad at D at one time. I got mad at D when that shit went on with J Dub and shit. You know, I had to go out there and slaughter fucking K Megan. He's going to come back with that cool shit. I was like, all right, you know what? I fuck, I'm sorry, but, you know, I keep telling him start releasing these tapes. They think I'll be bullshitting. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know, true stories, that's funny. Like people think that coke smoking shit was funny. It's a true fucking story. Yeah, I ain't lying. Like, no, like this dude's like, like, um, what is it? Char- Charlie Murphy and shit. Yeah. Real like, like, case like, like, they thought this shit was funny about 100, but about, I wasn't lying. He said that shit. <laughs> I could fuck any one of y'all boys anytime I want. I'm talking. I'm like, huh? Hey, what you <laughs> talking about? Like, there's only dudes up here. Like, oh, shit. Who wants you oh. from the waist below? Ain't never been in here, bro. What the fuck is going on? Like, <laughs> bro, ain't never been over here. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> yeah, they want my shrew. Like, who, 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 but again, I don't fuck with nobody either. So I tell y'all, motherfucker, when you see me last to fuck out, I mean, tell you, I mean, a lot of shit going on behind the scenes. They motherfuckers again didn't see that the the, the, the finished product. Oh, Z just being messy. Nah, I don't. I'm be being in my own little fucking world. But I got mad at D that day though, with, with that cool shit he was doing in there. But so who linked the DMs with K Mega? Come on now. He's oh. even Oh, shit. What? <laughs> <laughs> he said, who snitching? Yeah, who <laughs> 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 oh, because he was like an asshole. Oh, that's yeah, your that woman was his own business. Come on. <laughs> He's like, this is everybody snitching. <laughs> I said, what about Dylan? Are they snitching? Oh. That's the <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> it's, it's cool. <laughs> I said, you know what? I, I'm, I'm what them lying I'm eyes. I'm about to get this bird. I said, say one more goddamn thing. I was taking say, say something else, D. Say something. Nah, no, fuck, fuck, I'm about to go live. Fuck it, all right, D. What, what you want? What you want, D? I'm going live. Fuck. Mm-hmm. All right, man. Man. Oh, man. What he does in the bedroom is his own business. It's on stairs. You guys some bitch ass niggas. Holy the DMs. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> Holy DMs. Yeah. Hey, yo, D hopped in the He wanted to fight. Come on. Yeah. I'm doing it, We got snitches in this room. No. <laughs> oh. I have a presence. Who was it, you? You like the DMs? Like, D. Yo, this is one of the funniest shit that happened to YouTube, bro. This shit is, yeah. Fucking yeah. Gold, yo, yo. Hey, gold, it's been it's been one of hell of a year, man, for YouTube, yeah, man. man. And the comedy that came from it, and. Everything yeah, else, man. It's been a crazy yeah, year. yeah, and another low, another low that Xbox dude, the one that died, man. You know, uh, yeah, Xbox yeah. supporter. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, man. Oh, Shout out to his family. Him. Yeah, but I didn't know him, but you know, anytime you know somebody in the community, you know, shit bad happens. Wait, you know, else died, didn't he? Yeah, uh, what's the name? Died. Uh, I, uh, Ice Ninja. 
Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I, yeah, 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 yeah. Shout out to his him. wife. His wife is going to start loading some videos up. She said next nice year. Uh, he, he, he's he's a guy that used to you know he he used to be in our, our you know our comment section and stuff like that and oh, you know. oh okay now okay I got you oh yeah, subscribe yeah, again yeah. his wife being there for us yeah. or something right man you, you know what's crazy yeah, yeah. the yeah. other day she, or I, I forgot whose show was she was in there and uh, the ice cream the ice yes ice cream yeah, yeah ice cream yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. Was his wife I, yeah that was his wife yeah oh yeah. And, and so I, I went back through some of my old my old DMs. And I, I seen one where he had, you know, we were having having a conversation back and forth or whatever. And I was like, damn, it just just kind of brought up, you know, kind of some shit to reality. Like, yeah. man, you know, this console war and stuff. This is all for joking games, man. Is is it's brought us a, a lot of us here together now. You know, we're friends. We know, yeah, each other man. A lot of a lot of us hang out because of this shit, bro. Exactly. Oh, yeah, yeah, exactly. Sure. No, he talked to me simply because. Let me let me tell you how I met Z. Right. <laughs> <laughs> What what this is this is what triggered me, and I I got admit I got pissed off at this. This is the one time. This is one of the few times I'm like, man, fuck this shit. I'm tired of the bullshit, right? Mm -hmm. So Z had a podcast. You know, he had the you know the Pony versus Xbox podcast, right? My last straw, yo, they were getting yo ponies were getting slayed, bro. Yo, Ken Masters, I'm like, where the fuck they found this dude, bro? (laughs) Like, yo, I was like, yo, sometimes I think, yo, Z's getting the worst of the worst on the Sony side, and the best of the best. You know, like I'm like this motherfucker's right? back in the only. You know, I used to get an Xbox. worse than Don King. Hey, yo, I used to get a He's a piece of shit. Hey, I used to get an Xbox next to talking points and the questions before me. Yeah, I guarantee he did that shit. Like yo, he was asked a question. Oh, face was rigged. Oh, no, no, on the real. He was asked a question, right? And the Xbox, yo, they had a five paragraph essay. <laughs> And then when the when the ponies would talk, they're like, bleh, bleh, bleh. I'm like, yo, what the fuck is going on here? Like something, something spooky, right? <laughs> the last draw was with Jay Sentries and Rambo. And come to find out, Rambo wasn't even a PlayStation dude at the end. He goes, Oh, I really play on PC. I'm like, fuck your water. I hit up Z quick. Like, yo, son, I'm done with this shit. Fuck is you doing? And he's like, and then you show up then. Put me the game, and he, he had no idea what was coming, bro. He, yeah, he, 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 he unleashed the Kraken, bro. This motherfucker was like, oh, shit, bro. Like, I was murdering. That was Jay Century, I, I was murdering him, and Z started laughing. He's like, oh, shit. He's like, and Z tried to help him. Z's like, like, yo, we're going to stick to the questions. Yeah. And Jay's like, no, 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 I got this. We're going to talk about games. We're going to talk about services. And Z's like, I. I Yo, I ain't seen that nigga since Paul's. I ain't seen bro, that since, bro. He said, he said, he said, Jay Sentries was hollering at him every day. <laughs> Give me another one. After that, no more phone calls. Nobody. Yeah, was yo, crazy. D was like, yo, you fucking with my money, border. Like, <laughs> ain't nobody calling no more. Like, we didn't have a show for like months later until we brought it back for a little bit. Mm. Hey, I was like, and then we started a multiplayer podcast. Yeah, that's, that's, it. that's when that's when that shit got created with Beat Shadows. Yeah. Fucking all day, yeah. Um, MVP, K- that shit was wild, bro. Can't make it, yeah. Can't you know, make it. MVP don't know how to fucking work Discord. I'm trying to, you know, he want to join the show. You talking about dog? I don't want to see MVP. You don't know how to work Discord, his bum ass. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck yeah, MVP. But you know, but we're doing that. Yo, this shit was good time, bro. That that's how that shit started. Bro. It started because of I got tired of this scene Xbox. And pony, hey, yo, they said they were, they were all bums, bro. That shit was a moment. Hey, yo, they was all bums, bro. Yo, 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 in terms of uh, billion dollar franchises, who has the most billion dollar franchises? It might be yeah. yourself. You asking Sony. these weird questions. I was like, <laughs> he was asking all these fucking questions. I'm like, what kind of fuck shit is this? <laughs> I was like, fuck shit. Like, he was asking questions like. Uh, who started achieving first? I'm like, what the <laughs> fuck is going on here? And then they all the PlayStation guys did try to all oh, trophy started first. I'm like, oh my god, hey, yo, bro, I ain't that deck like, the yo, they were looking bad. They were like, oh, this is hey, bro, hey, bro. Hey, listen, man, listen, these I'm coming out to you. All this, all my debates have been rigged. Like, man. No, see what it has. Z wouldn't ask who had the highest rated games. He knew what questions to ask. Who had the most billion dollar games? Uh-huh. And I'm like, this motherfucker right here, bro. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, oh, so what came and up you first? got things Xbox like, oh, 
Or Back PSN. Million dollars. I'm like, oh, then what was that for Xbox Live? Or yeah, I'm like, you ask questions like that, and and um, these dudes like, oh, you know, PlayStation had internet <laughs> since, since the 90s in Japan. I'm like, oh my god, bro, I'm done. Oh my god. I'm oh, like, yo, Ken Masters, bro, he will come up with the wildest shit. I'm like, yo, I'm done. I'm, done. I'm like, yo, I'm taking over. That was the day I put on the mask. I'm like, yo, yeah, yeah. it's a thousand dollars, G. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, shit. But yo, man, thanks for rocking out with us, bro. Show, Hope you enjoy the show. show. 28, we're going to bring Digital Streets back. I know we've been Bullshit, slacking. Man. They keep hitting me up about that shit. You know what I'm saying? Up. You know what I'm saying? Fucking, yeah. fucking ZZ on his diabetic medicine. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, we're going you know, to we're gonna bring that shit back. We're going to bring it back for the New Year's and shit like that. 60 frames, no lights coming back for the New Year's and everything. You know what I'm saying? But I wish you all a Merry Christmas. Happy New Year, Kwanzaa, whatever the fuck y'all celebrate. I hope y'all enjoy it. Keep it gaming. And we out this motherfucker. Peace. Shout out to everybody in the chat, man. Mm, sing the lying <laughs>